Visual BB Star Flavored Milk Drink comes in apple flavor and orange flavor. Contains calcium, helps in supporting strong bones. Visual BB Star for Smart Kid. Surgery, did you go for? Uh, I can I don't urinate very well. You know they urinate very well. Uh, they say in a bag of water. Bag of water. Uh, Were you? Uh, so when I go scan again, they say the first scan I do for a few years, they say they are. 
I will do another surgery again. Okay. So the hospital say now like 350. So the surgery, the man can say, why my left kidney no day? That's how I know me. Before the same man do another scan, go still do another scan. They say another place. Uh, they say they remove the kidney. Which hospital? Oh, what? Five years ago. What will be the name of the hospital? Head drugs. We are their card there. No go to card. Why you never no hold the card? Now evidence where you get to show say you be patient for that hospital. This man here if he lie against the hospital. I don't know whether you understand. It's just like person tells you they work for for it be police and you no get ID card. Hmm? You go go bring that. But that it will be tomorrow. Because you will not get them at all. Um, nah. The only one who I see gets deal with my husband and don't separate. So you know that me enter the house. But the car did it. Why is going to hospital? Yeah, the car deal with your husband. Yeah. You need to wait for the with and the payment to deal with that. What do you make when I separate with your husband? I think they beat me, so I don't come up for us. He used um, mother this to come with me for a bath. So the phone can come out. That one come out. As I treat and finish, I say I know my, my people, they say I must go back. Now I say I know go back. You carry mother piece to beat you, so till the bone come out. Yes. So I say I know. But the bone don't go back. It's still dead there. So if I go to collect the thing, you know that I'm in the house. Yes, How many children are there? Four. Where are the children there? They will die. Will they allow you to see the children? No, now if they go to school, if you go to school, they sit there. What tribe is your husband? Mm -hmm. What tribe are you? Which state are you from? Mm -hmm. Which state is your husband? I'm mm from -hmm. the same place. Which local government you are own? What? The same Okasa. What will be the name of your village? Obuno. Obuno. What of your own village? Obuno. You go lay your complaint. You not go mention the name of the hospital first. Uh, you go need to carry police to go with her. Madam, you are late. Go back. She knows. She knows. This is not the first time. Now, so any time when she comes late, she go sneak enter. Just go back. Now. You understand? Okay. Um. <coughs> You go lay your complaint about the hospital, but well, you never know, mention the name of the hospital too. When it happened, how it happened, your condition now. And then when I ask you, the way I ask you about your husband, you go tell us, say, when I know they together, then you go narrate your story. You see, why would they do this one now? Because If you marry another woman, at the same thing you go to do. The thing we need to make them understand. Say, what thing you do, they wrong. And then, with the police, when we go involved, they go, we go fit obtain such warrant from the court to enable her pick the receipt that will serve as an evidence because without that receipt. Oh, card, hospital. How you no go get card for hospital? You go pay money. You know the man be there massacre that time. So come get, come get, come buy one place for bigger place. Uh, uh, big place. So as we go there, we no go there as new custom, new. Hey, but when I get the old card, don't take but.
everybody in the open air studio inside the compound of human rights radio and television the headquarters of bracket family reality radio and television talk magazine program please kindly stand up for the national pledge after the count of three one two three go i, I pledge, pledge to nigeria, nigeria my country, country to, to be, be faithful, faithful loyal and honest to serve nigeria with all my strength to defend her unity and uphold her honor and glory so help me god so help us god as a nation nigeria amen amen yes in akwa na eka ro tutu ma gbo ba ba pe da so kele o le gbe na bi an se kan kan nwa se nga do bre utra mi mamu a chinga na fo kwa inu ta shi ma nye be ste na te shure o shure ongo sona le nongo nyali ashego ishalafia ya kafunga mama mbilolo ndaire wa eluma ata numare wa shiye ye wona jinjire mbawaji ani mere mere akwa wale jam una good morning Good morning, ordinary presidents. Good morning, ge ge go ge ge ge. Good morning, ordinary presidents. Good morning, ge go ge go ge ge ge. Good morning, ordinary presidents. G C O N, double doctor. Double ambassador, one, Lazy man, wake up. Lazy woman, wake up. Lazy brother, wake up. Lazy sister, wake up. Lazy auntie, leave that bed. Lazy uncle, you still lie down. Now, auntie, I just talked to just now. She will be woman. Uncle, you still the fun fine boy. The form say you be first class material. You get second class upper. You still the form say you still young. Uncle, the reason why they call you uncle now because these children when they call you uncle, they see you say their father na small it takes senior you. Or you and their papa are the same age. Or maybe you even senior their papa. Some people know they're useful to themselves. Talk more of being useful to the nation. You can never give what you don't have. Some people, they, they don't get direction for life. Some people they if you tell them waiting and waiting their plan to do today, they know if you tell you. They just come out, they just break. They can never chart their course against the direction of the wind. Some people don't get plan for life. They just they answer citizens. And I then Sabi condemn government pass. If you go where people gather, either inside a bus. Joint where you won't start conversation when we say people go join you. Start by insulting the government. Hey, hey, hey they not do this one, they not do that one, they not do. Yes, some of the things not true. Now the same people we gather, they condemn government, they insult government, they do everything. Ask them, what will be the solution? For you to know, say negativity don't enter them. So they na negative them be. They not ever think and say, okay, waiting, supposing they call me now as a citizen, say, make a proper solution over this particular complaint, where they complain and lament. So, waiting, I go talk. It has never done on some of us. A bunch of noisemakers where we be. Some of us are criminals. 
carry palliative, give somebody now for their area, say, share, make everybody get 5, 5 kg. You go surprise, some people no go get the 5 kg. You go go to the person's house, you go see about seven bags of such 5, 5 kgs. And now you get mouth to insult our leaders. At that your level, leadership now different, different category B. Some men are not so responsible to the extent that in their homes, they are not doing what is expected of them as father and husband. Now you, they live for area. Now you, they do bypass. Call Nepa too. They go bypass meter for you. Now you, they lie up and down. Now you, they pay money, make the right exam for your child in order for your child to pass exam. Even though now government policy make education day very difficult. Other parts of the world, education no day difficult again. Here, you won't do masters, you go so far. You they pursue degree program. Your course mate, where you are and finish secondary school, don't finish degree. You don't finish masters. You don't come back. Even if Nakotonu, you enter. Even if Nagana, you enter. Now Nigeria be the country where suit strike don't become uniform. Where we they wear, whether we like, whether we no like, we are not so ashamed of ourselves and our leaders. So shameful. People will enjoy free education, free meal in school, free this, free that. Now them be the ones waiting for corridor of power today. They have frustrated the lives of the ordinary Nigerians. Their children, they school abroad. Then they go hospital abroad. Our hospitals upgraded mortuaries. You get hospitals for Abuja here. Once uh, here, say you they carry your patient, go there, I go call you, say I beg, keep him for house, no go, because in condition go worse in the next three days. And these hospitals, now government hospitals, way way plenty for Abuja here. The only hospital that is functioning well at the moment that we know, and is a government hospital is Federal Medical Center Jabi. I no talk say make you believe me. Disguise yourself, go there in any condition. You go see the way they go receive you from gate. Let's appreciate them. <laughs> the rest, now nah, my boy, carry person. Wait, he, he, if he breathe, he go take and like 60 seconds, I'll be two minutes before he go do hey, again. When we say, even person will not be medical personnel, if you see him, you know, say this condition, an emergency condition. They go, they ask him, where did this happen to them? You know him before. Where did him be his name? When you don't ex already explain to them, say, now nah, accident where you meet, people, they pass. You decide. As a patriotic Nigerian, we get humanity inside of you. You decide to carry on. Person, they unconscious. Then they ask you, what him be his name? When did thing happen? Who and who they there? Waiting and waiting. When they can't agree, you go pay money for this before they go do this, they go do this, then go do this. By the time you are done, the person don't die. The other day, yesterday, National Population Commission Day here. I've been prepared to ask them questions. We, we go turn their belly. But I just feel, say, make I give them safe landing, make them go do research, come back. I know be National Assembly, I know be pre presidential villa where you go come do PowerPoint presentation, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we want to give you, give you our achievements uh, milestone by milestone. No. For every statement where you make, we read in between the lines. I feel no go school, but I get common sense. And common sense, no day common. Now I make madman will be the commonest man, no get them. See, we think our children, they suffer in the name of education. Say, you must do jam. Who they do jam? Big men, children, where they school abroad, Oxford, Cambridge, even Biscuit. 
which 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 one of them carry jam resort go before they give her admission? Now your children they go they frustrate. Some of our children will not think say dollars then be no, they are super intelligent. Now systems failure nine nine reduce them to that. Some of your children are emotionally down. Pekin no say he no de be dollar. School where they go, lecturer no they even they they are teacher no they, they enter class when it supposed enter class. The method of teaching, teaching methodology zero. Good morning class, make you answer me. Good morning sir. Uh, today we are going to talk about Petit Penti. Petit Penti was. Established in the year 1822. Repeat after me. The first director general of Penti Penti was Pantemini Piri Mawa. Now, make one Pekin, one student, they were they curious. Because amongst our children, the one where they ask questions where were, were na sign of leadership and sign of super intelligence, in case you don't know. Piki where you wear a shoe. This one different, this one different. You say, Mommy, why did you wear, the, you wear different shoes? As at that time, say, hey, your mind no go there. Yes. Now there you go check. My children, they ask me a question. Where are they take boju boju? They pursue them. <laughs> when they ask me some kind of question, I go just take idea. Either I begin cough or something. I answer call where they no call me. I go enter. I go Google them. You not belong to my generation for crying out loud. How I go pay my children's school fees? He said the way they go teach them, they go give them homework, make them carry come. Make me a, why am I paying? Why make I keep them for house, carry lesson teacher? Let them do homeschooling. Now back to why I branch off now because education don't die for Nigeria. Forget anything we get anything anybody go tell you. This lie, we government, they lie every year. The federal government has earmarked so so billion naira to education. Now share, then they share them, share um, amongst themselves. We know. And in Nigeria, you still, they promote you. Now it make, make one they check right from time. When it's right, it reach time to promote directors to permanent secretary positions, if vacancy day. Over 90% of the people where they qualify to become permanent secretaries now director, admin, and finance. Why? Because now they don't have money enough to give bribe to qualify. Now back to what we did talk. I did still talk about you getting, making plans for your life. At whatever level you are, see yourself as a leader. Live an exemplary life. Simple. And the foundation, apart from home, the next thing now to put Peking for school, now make school, they very, very fundamental. Now for our schools, then they teach us history to tell us a Mango Park, now in Discover River Niger, who be in father? As at the time when Mango Park did here, about two, about three generations of fisher, fishermen don't die there with them, bury them. They had leadership. They were organized before water carry and come down River Niger side. It was in a plateau you go there for Chopam that time. But the, these people, they, they admire and they, they wonder. This man, in ear red, he knows they one kind. Hospitality. Then give them fresh fish pepper soup. The cold way and time, but it begins to come out. It begins to sneeze. Hapsha! Hapsha! They carry Godo. Holding this blanket cover him. This man survived. They treat him well. They won't write Nigeria's history. They say Mango Park discovered River Niger. And we take and pass. The thing where they pain me, I take and pass exam. I was misled. It's so annoying. And yet we have leaders so-called leaders that cannot criticize, analyze, dissect, and give us the right direction. 
Some of them are occupiers of leadership position because their leadership is non-effective. As a matter of fact, the presidency should declare education within state of emergency. Step one. Today, Nigerians, they produce graduates when of it defend their discipline. How could a, a country like Nigeria say English and mass is mandatory? Before you can secure an admission, English and mass. But with all these things where I mentioned, Nigeria is not the worst country in the world. And from the look of things, we are beginning to get it right. Do you believe that? Yes, sir. Have you seen the sign? Yes, the minister that came yesterday is a sign. Let's appreciate Nigeria. We just hope, okay, we just hope say they go allow mm. Nigeria. Anything will good, no, they last. Yes. This camp minister now, they go go gang up against some go meet President Bola Ametunibu. Your Excellency, this young man is too forward. Mm -hmm. He's too forward. No, 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 no. This is not the way we run government in Nigeria. No, 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 no. He is going to say something that will come. <laughs> And if you not get, although one thing where I thank God for President Bola Ahmed Inubu is the fact that he is lucky to have an intelligent wife. Let's appreciate that woman. That woman is equivalent to 200 men put together. May I go check her record for National Assembly? She is a strong woman. She is kind-hearted. She is a leader that listens. So we are lucky that our president this time around is lucky to have a good wife. Not be the one where they slap DSS for villa. Not be the one where in daughter go use, well, that's Buhari. In daughter use SIM card through away finish. Network people, empty and recycle and one young man buy them. They arrest them. Beat nonsense come up for him, but you go detain him. Slap, slap workers for inside villa, including the DSS operative. That is say we don't know. We know. Just because you keep quiet, no not mean say we don't know what they happen. And if I know the destruction where Buhari government don't do Nigeria, in the next 20 years, it will take an effective leader to save Nigeria out of this, this destruction that happened during Buhari's regime. Even this LFME, this uh, central bank governor, Elefiemi. This one way. Former. Uh, former uh, hen. Now nah, he's still dead here. Now nah, he's boy, they put there. <laughs> Elefiemi. This one way, the day where they won't carry and go court, you wear Jalabi and carry Bible. Mm. <laughs> After the thief money finished, they, they go, they form sickness or holiness. Since where we know Elefiemi, we ne even in workers, no see him with Bible before. But you won't enter court. You won't whip sentiment and some ignorant Christians. Not be everybody will be a Christopher and I be Muslim. And I be Christian. Not be everybody will be a Muhammad and I be Muslim. So I think they worry you now. If they want to destroy this country, they will just bring something that has either religious, ethnic, or tribal connotation or sentiment. Hey! People will not reason beyond their noses. This is where we talk now. Make we face waiting gather us here. Nigeria must be better than it is, whether they like it or not, by the grace of God. Yeah. We will I not mean. allow them. We will not allow them. I have replicated my type in their thousands as we speak in Nigeria. You can only kill the messenger. Can you kill the message? No. We are not fighting any government. We are not fighting anybody. 
All we are looking after is a better society for everybody. No be country where person go thief billions of naira they go go Kano Emirate Council give and t chief tansy title. No be where person go thief money they go talk say in the name of plea bargain. Person thief trillions of naira they say bring 500 billion naira you are free to go. Such a person can contest because they no carry and go prison. Other people will start that thing. They go collect that money. You go stay staff, staff prison time. Let it be on record that you were once a thief and an ex-convict. Here, once you pay the money, we have a price tag to everything, including our conscience. What is wrong with us as a, as a people? Every day while they do my program, I know they get the belief, say, I go do on the following day. But if today... Oh, yesterday's program was my last program. So be it. If today's own, so be it. Any life that is useful to you alone is a useless life. Now, think about yourself. Ask yourself this question. You've been get planned for today. Apart from coming to break at a family, what other thing you get for mine to do? Nothing. Then you are dying already. Waiting, they keep person alive now. Hope, and the only thing where they generate hope now activities. Are we together? Yes, sir. Una hembe lembe. Oh, lo, lo, lo. <laughs> my brothers, my sisters, if when I look and I say, say, time don't they give us signal, signal to do things, signal make we continue to deliver, not they go. Yesterday, he gave us uh, something where. Somebody called me from National Primary Healthcare Development Agency. I don't forget his name. He said, I'm the director of vaccine for over 10 years. He said, he had that in when I talked yesterday. He said, in go light to shed more light on the matter. I said, to. I said, I go call him back. For night, I can't see him message say he never hear from me and that time i still did for office i did do meeting with uh, the mandate secretary health and environment fct one young you know promising energetic lady like that i you know so after the meeting when i go i can't send a message he say whether he go get opportunity to either call in to or to come i tell him yes make you come but he never peak. You know, Nigerian civil servants, like the mandate secretary will come with civil servants today. Some of them, they swear for her for their mind because they are not used to waking up early. Nigerian civil servants, some of them are so redundant that they are not useful to themselves, but they thought they are, che che they are, they are cheating the government. Some of them, in mid, now make then they fake their date of birth to in order to elongate the, uh, their stay in because outside government office they are useless some of them. Now then go the buga. I'm a director. I'm an assistant director. I'm a deputy director. The only thing with the, the Sabina to torture the ones where they under them to show say then they important. But some of them are good. Now I make some people go retire. After some years, they go come back to the ministry. Go they hear, oh yo, yo, oh yo. They say who? They say the, the former director, some are former AD, some are uh, AD, assistant director, some are former DD, a former director. So so person say, ah, now good man, no, oh, that time where are they level 13? Um, uh, level uh, level nine. He, he was like a father to me. The same person, the same person. Some people go go back to the ministry. The security go recognize them. You know, go allow them pass. Now then go this talk. Akpan, not na me, na me. They say, eh? you they walk here again. <laughs> then when others don't, they pass like this for inside their motto. That time when he did, they don't no get motto. Now the day is a motto. He go greet them. Hello, how are you? This young man is not allowing me to go in. Then, you know, civil servants courtesy and diplomacy. 
You say, ah, why, why won't you allow him? Now, our former Agabi, he go say, oh, wait, wait, let me pack. He go, go, go inside, call the security man. Don't allow him. When I will be your guy for offices, now we get like six, five uh, years to go. Be, even if you don't do wicked before, learn to be nice now because your days are numbered. One day, even if you don't go back there, you feel jam some, some people with you, the wicked somewhere. One good turn deserves another. Not be another, multiple. Are we together? Yes. So, um, today, when I go hear about the vaccine, why government carry and come, why is they important, why, 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 and we will go ask them questions. Good idea, yes? Yes, sir. Our own na accountability. We know say Nigeria no get better lab. Giant way no get uh, way no get weight. Lassa fever they carry sample go Kenya. This one they carry sample go Nigeria. Go carry sample they go abroad. Because we, some of us are not so patriotic. Some machines they way government don't supply to some places. They never open them for leather till the machine go they obsolete. Newer versions go don't come. We go push that one aside because of wicked leadership in some of these our offices. Even during that Buhari time, where they talk, say they fail. There is no ministry, department, or agency of government where demand money. We go make impact on the lives of Nigerians where President Muhammad Buhari no give them the money. Now still they still are. Once you can convince him that this, this, this thing will add value to Nigerians, you go just approve. Somebody for Villa even tell me, say, sometimes you go ask them, Una sure say this money go do uh, for uh, all these things when I explain to me, you go say, they go say yes, you go approve. The only major issue with Buhari's administration was lack of supervision and monitoring and a pure accountability. You give your wife money, buy turkey, buy pomo, buy this, buy meat, buy. They cook the soup. You know, see turkey sign. You know, see now only pomo you see. You know, ask question. Let's assume now the first time be that. Second time again, you give money. Third time again, you give. Then you are a fool as a husband. Even the woman no go respect you. Because she knows in Adondi United, she marry. <laughs> Women, they talk and they say they know they like to make to men. They, they like man who will carry authority. No be man who will carry over authority where they beat woman. Now an animal. Now a queer. Any man will go feel raise hand, hit woman, whether in wife or not in wife, na queer. Bah. If na your brother, na queer. If na your father, na queer. If na your husband, na queer, you marry. And people for community, any man where they beat in wife, make one gather him. Make one not beat him. But make sure you say, you know, if you beat woman again. Embe, lembe. I just say made them beat them. No. I say made them gather them. <laughs> Under the law, every citizen has the right to subdue a criminal. You can prevent a crime from happening. You can subdue. You can hand over to police. You get waiting. This is uh, uh, Barrister Ogo. Yes. That is uh, subdued and uh -huh. yes, sir. So, but make sure say before you know this kind of people go to struggle after beating their wives. Mm. So, make sure say you know if you struggle for police hand, yes, sir. Carry soft copy, give police. Mm. Good idea, yes, yes, yes sir. sir. That not bitter more, but make sure say now soft, soft copy. You know, the world is moving forward, yes, sir. Digital, yes. 
Now be they call soft copy. Yes, you make a soft magidi, you know? Hand over. Police go tank on her. Mm. <laughs> if you reach police station, you go take her like four hours before. Uh, Kelechi asked me, what is your name, Mr. Ma, where they beat your wife? What is your name, Mr. Ma, where they beat your wife? <laughs> Soft copy. I could do it here. My dear president, you know, say soft copy, they're easy to upload. Uh, because if not hard copy, go first go scan mm, out yeah, before you begin to upload them. But what's that soft copy? It, all this car you know how to do Oh, we are not encouraging violence anyway. And, and ordinary president, you know, say that is one way to help our police. Yes. You don't give them what subjects them to stress mm. and struggle. Mm. Uh, we are the, citizens. This good citizens help. must be able to help the police. Yes. Uh, because even there are some kind of people because of the way they struggle, they go dirty a uniform. But if you soften the mm -hmm. copy. Mm -hmm. Hand them over. Mm -hmm. uh, police go just, you know, even need handcuffs. Yeah, they go just carry and put her for back of moto. Uh. Mm. <laughs> One in no 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 beat them. Yes, sir. I thought they made them beat anybody. No, sir. What we okay. do here is what we, is called at the global arena open education mm. and lifelong learning. It has an international curriculum. Mm. Mm. Yes, what we are doing here is open learning and lifelong education. Go and Google it. Have you no go school? But I they, I get people who go school around me. Are we together? Yes, sir. You must learn one thing. Minimum of one thing every day via this program. And I they tell people, when I hear people say, ah, I never hear this, your program. I say, no worry, no hear. Her. Maybe one day you go carry complaint, come. <laughs> Another person, ah, no, they get time. I say, the highest you can do is just listen once. After once, don't listen again. After like one year, I'm not a president. This is your program. I say, that time where I listen to them one day. Now, nah, so, I know they feel sleep that time again. No, I must listen. You know, concern me. You are helping yourself. Because things where we they expose here. Nobody say we they expose because mouth they scratch us no with evidence. With substantiation. You get one case where I do where they say I know if you substantiate. When I begin to substantiate, now the same people could tell me say no substantiate again. <laughs> For every evidence why I give, where you hear me talk here, I only I am only able to present 30% to you. I will keep 70%. If you challenge me, I release another 30%. That is enough to destroy you. If you do agree, agree go court. Good morning, sir. You no, know, so everything where we do here and awaiting the Lord talk. Uh, 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 now, section 39 of the police act. Now in same people they arrest. No be saying a police, but you go hand over to mm. the police. Mm. Yes, mm. after interrogation, so that you go get evidence where you go present before the police. You don't do it, don't do it. Uh, don't do it. You don't do it, don't do it. You don't do it. When I go to school, make a clap on myself. You get one pathetic case where we want to take start this morning. Madam, please come forward. Guide her properly. Enter the. Please, madam, because of your condition, just leave it there. Thank you. Because of your condition, you go prefer to sit down. I be you won't stand. You have a choice, ma. I feel stand. Talk to the man. I feel stand, sir. You feel stand. Yes, sir. And you do comfortable with the standing? Yes, sir. Okay. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning, sir. Yes, Barrister Ogo? Yes, sir. Please place her on, on oath. Okay, repeat after me. Raise your right raise hand. Your, uh, raise your right hand. Mm -hmm. I. I. Your full name. Edna Eze. Do solemnly swear. 
do summary sway. Declare and affirm. Declare and affirm. That the complaints and evidence. That the complaint and evidence. I shall give. I shall give. Shall be the truth. Shall be the truth. The whole truth. The whole truth. And nothing but the truth. And nothing but the truth. So help me God. So help me God. Thank you. Thank you. Yesterday, we take idea revisit one case of a young man where in name na Solomon Bawa where he did in own just sit down sir he did on his own he did do farming and he did drive pickup to earn a living he no grigo thief one day he he get tire problem he lose the tire to go buy something. He did the shop where they buy nine policemen, three policemen approach him. Say, are you uh, Gambo Bawa? He say, no, my name is Solomon Bawa. One of the policemen tell him, say, okay, go. According to him, as he don't they go, another policeman come call him. Say, come back here. Are you not uh, Gambo Bawa? He say, no, I be Solomon Bawa. Like play, like play. They carry and go massacre. Abi? Yes, massacre police station. Keep them like play. That thing where police they do. They don't do unto me before. Policeman go just carry. No, no, no. no there's no problem. Uh -uh. You just to obtain your statement. I, you will go. He go keep you. For front here. When I go they gist with them. Small time you go signal them. You go come out. Time don't reach for another shift to take over. When they, they do handing over, they go say, hey, which of this one? They say, no, now nah, inspector, so so, I be sergeant, so so, I be corporal, so so, now nah, keep her here. He say, what do you do? They say, we don't know. But then this person go to, now talk, say, make one put on for back of counter. You don't they go with that too. From where you wear your shoe and your belt, they don't come out. You go sit down there. Then they hear me, the wicked ones. They keep you there. Then. Somebody go pass. Who is this man? Which offense he commit? They say, ah, that time your name no day for board. He say, no, we don't know. Now, Sergeant, this, then Inspector, this, come talk, say, eh, hey, okay. Eh, hey, make you no come be saying that he commit. Put her for sale. Some of them are in prison as we speak. They have spent five years, seven years, some 15 years, still counting. They don't know what they do. Some, they, they take them. Exchange criminal. That is, if you are lucky, you are still alive. Some they go kill you. Put gun on top of your chest. Call pressmen. Say, see, waiting they kill. Apple seven up till now. Apple seven. I be apple four. Apple seven. The man where even lead the op apple six where lead the operation where they lead to killing those people. They even give them promotion for police. Yes, now, this young man, Solomon Bauer, like play, like play, they begin torture him. From there to stay CID, Lafia. Stay CID, Lafia. Begin torture him. So they then do. Stand up, make them see how they condemn. That right hand has gone. Come, come to the front. Uh -huh. Stand there, stand there. Camera. Dro drop the hand small. That hand is no longer functioning. And this left hand, they, uh, they took um, something where blood they gush out. Now only God saved that second hand. Support the hand, sir. I know, say. Now, so this man, from police station, from life, C state CID, life here. They take and direct to prison. No court. He goes spend three years for Kefi prison. Abi? Yes, the controller of that prison, he enter one day. He asked him question. He discovered, say, the man they die, they go for him prison. If they fear made this man no die. He said, made them transfer him to which prison? prison From Lafia prison yes, to Kefi prison. You do three years for uh, Lafia, can't do one year for Kefi prison. For offense where you no commit. In fact, when did they torture him? Another, give, hold microphone for him, I beg. So that the whole world go hear the injustice. No, madam, hold your own. When did, 
Waiting be the name of the inspector. Wait, torture you, condemn, deform you so. Inspector Usman Angbashi. Angbashi. Yes, sir. Now, in the course of beating, when they see, say, other policemen see, say, you don't condemn this hand already, and if they try, you don't choke you something, blood they come out. Waiting, one of the policemen tell you. Uh, one um, inspector, uh, Ado Beture. Mm -hmm. He can tell me, say, make an answer, say, now nah, maybe Bawa Gumbo, if not, this one go kill me, no case, who. Now nah, I can't answer. Say, now nah, him. Yes. He can't ask you, say, uh, say what do you thief? Uh, say, me, I, uh, where the motorcycle, where I thief? So I can't tell and say, no, thief, now nah, he can't want. Beat you again. Yes, now nah, I can't say, I thief one. Mm -hmm. He can't open eye for me, now nah, I can't add one again. Yeah. He can't start right, sir. You can't carry you go prison. Yes, sir. Now, the fourth year when he did for the second prison. Yes, sir. Nahim, this thing no heavy. Hold the mm -hmm. microphone, my friend. Don't be lazy. Mm -hmm. Tin the warrior. Nahim, one good lawyer, God fearing barrister C Y Marshall. 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 Yes, sir. She go prison visit. Now she see where prisoners gather. This man, mm -hmm. they put on hot water because. No medical treatment. Yes, sir. Now, dear, she ask him a question. He can't narrate the story as I talk him. Mm -hmm. She say, which evidence go show say you know be mm. Gambo Bawa, 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 but Solomon Bawa. He say he go primary school. He do he do junior work. Yes, do. sir. Now, so this barrister use her money trace in village. Mm. Go discover, say, they come carry in primary school certificate. I don't know whether we're going scan on that day, put. Mm. Because we're not going to leave this matter. Even the Minister of Interior tell me, say, you're not going to leave this matter. Now, if the documents don't get ready, we're not going to show them. Now, they can't get in primary school certificate. Waiting they write on top. Solomon Bawa. Your, second, your junior wire. Solomon Bawa. Your senior wire. Solomon Bawa. Now she, now she carry go court to prove the innocence. This same inspector Usman Angbashin Abi, yes sir, is still serving in this country. Now for a fellow inspector, a fellow policeman, to look at a suspect and tell him, you better accept. If not, this man will kill you, and there will be no case. It means say. Inspector Usman Angbashin, don't they kill people? Some NSAS protesters still there for prison. They're there for detention. That one, another matter where we go face, face to face. Even though some of them overdo. The ones who overdo go carry their cross. The innocent ones go there. Now, so. This young man, which day you regain your freedom? On 31st of August this year. 2023. Yes, sir. We don't carry and go to the first hospital. They say hope no day for that hand. But we they go to the second hospital. We're not going to give up. Because it does say it they feel small, small pain around this area. But here, you, the hand they shrink, they go. Mm. Sir. You yes, will sir. get justice by the grace of God. Amen, sir. You will get justice by the grace of God. Amen, Amen, sir. You will get. You must get justice by the grace of God. Amen, Amen. sir. Thank you very much. You Thank can you, go sir. Back. Thank you. Maybe we appreciate sir. that. Now, madam, over to you. Okay. Now, this woman, as I attend to people outside, she talk one thing. We touch all of us, me particularly. Why I choose her first now? Because when I they do random attendance, I they consider the disabled, the elderly, and the pregnant. So I see her as a pregnant woman. I say, Madam, come forward. Tell me your story. She say she go hospital. Then thief her kidney. Uh -uh. Which hospital? Now they are family hospital where they been they go for one place before the man gather money, come buy big place, bigger place.
they can't follow and go there. This woman will stand here. She's not pregnant. Now water full her belly. So. That way she gets similar symptoms. Say she knows they feel they urinate easily. Now they carry her, according to her, to the hospital. Five years ago, as the man operator, he teeth her one of her kidneys. Now the one will come pay me pass. The husband where she and unborn four children beat her so that she run come off her house. The one way touch me, according to her, he carry mortar piston, hit her for back. So the bone up till now the bone since when he hit you for back with that mortar piston? Yes. Since which year? Like five years or six years now. The bone still there. They, they say the, they go operator. Now I make I say, make we listen to this woman. Even for her to see her children, she know they feel he deny her access. Now sneak she they sneak. School where they put the children. If she won't see her children, she go stay for offense. She go see her children. She go get rest of mind. She tell the owner of the hospital to make another alarm. The school. Enter. Uh, now outside. I know. Now. Should we allow that to continue? No. no, answer me. Should we allow that? No. Should we teach the husband a very good lesson? Yes. So that other men learn. will learn to respect women. Yes. Women must be respected. Yes. Not should be respected. Must be respected. Let him be your husband's name. Chukuka Eze. We are in the work. Urban mass. Urban Tra mass. Transportation. Urban mass is under FCT administration. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That makes it a lot easier. Yes, sir. Monday secretary is here. Even though no be her department, she has the influence. Now them be the people where they, where they sit down, do meeting with the FCT minister. So she can call whoever is in charge of urban mass. Summon him and the driver and the staff to come for us to continue with this matter. We no go continue. Just hold on there. We, because we know what make people sabi the next line of action. Okay, Madam, sir, you will be okay by the grace of God. Thank you, sir. So how you take the survival now? Since we your husband pursue you. Now, one of my friends with the Kabusa. Nadia, you the manager. Yes, sir. She said my conde with her. That kind of friend. Now, friend for life. Yes, sir. F -f -f -f. Now, friend for life. Yes, sir. Friend, when we say, in this your condition, she still accepts you. No. Such friends are not easy to come by in this our generation. So who they cook, who they provide food for that house? Sometimes I borrow money for my friend, 40,000, what they use for. So the money don't finish. Sometimes she should give me money. You know, as I come well, I know they cook for that house. Cook, but buying food now is cheaper than cooking. So we we'll buy food house. Um... Elder, where is the second microphone? You, morning, you don't get president. any business where you go feed do. Where I get, I go there, they call me, I go there, they say, I know if you do the work, so I get belly. Now I say, I no get belly. They say, I know if you work. So first of all, what thing we go do? Uh, Kelechi, you go carry this woman and go to the hospital, Alliance Hospital. I'm footing the bill 100%. Oof. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. And as you they go, they go give you 50 kg of rice. They go give you 100,000. Hey, thank you, sir. sir. God bless you. Yes. Thank you, sir. No, no, thank you, thank you, thank you. Sir, thank you. God bless you. Thank you, sir. Kai, God bless you, sir. God bless you. Thank you. If you know what I don't suffer for this sickness, I don't say everything what I get.
all the native native one. I don't do the thing no green go. I go believe go spend eighty thousand. The thing no see go. My sibling, if I tell them they, they get the money, oh, but they go tell me man go back husband house before they go feel help me. As I see the way the man they beat me, say man go back again. They say man must go back before they go help me. Now I run come off for village. Come meet my this my friend. Waiting be that your friend name. If he, if you she they work. She they sell for for, for good mechanic. Okay. She too. In nobody say I they pay her. Just to show my appreciation. Okay, sir. Say she they kind to humanity. Yes. They will give you fifty thousand naira and you give her for a charge card. Thank you, sir. Mm, yes, God sir. bless you. Yes, Thank sir. you, sir. Please call for me to do that immediately. And then you they go hospital today by the Hi, fact. Hi, God. Uh, you must be okay by the grace of Thank God. You, uh, Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. God bless you. Amen. And men they do this thing to torture their wives. You pursue woman, you divorce her, you come prevent her from having access to her children. You have killed her psychologically. Women are more attached, most of the times, women are more attached to their children than the, than the men. Only in few instances. Hello? Uh, Fe uh, Femi Usman, formerly of GT Bank, now of Eco Bank with double promotion. Good morning, my account officer. Good morning, my Good morning, sir. Yes, they go send you one account number now, now. Okay, sir. You go send... 150,000 naira to her. She go remove 50,000 naira, uh, give Percy way they accommodate her, and she go carry 100,000 naira. Okay. And then you go, you I'm go, you go, numbers. yeah, they go send them to you now. Then you go liquidify uh, 500,000 naira, where somebody go bring them cash to the studio. Make we use and deposit for hospital hey. first before Jesus. any other thing. Okay. Thank you, sir. Madam, you don't need your God is still alive. Amen. God know they forget what he creates. Yes. Okay. Which church should they go? Anglican. And then they see you like this. Nobody seems to care. I they tell them they no get they money. No worry. No worry. Your God is still alive. Amen. Thank you, sir. God will know they forget insect. Insect go there for bush. Time for them. They don't pray. May they, they chop bread. Some don't pray. May they chop puff puff. And there is no village around. People will embark on a journey. Yes, sir. If more to no spoil for that particular spot, somebody go talk, say, you want to urinate. Yes, sir. Now that time somebody go see say this bread no, no good again. He go throw away inside that bush. Now God direct you to feed what He create. Talk more of you. We be human being. Thank God you are a Christian. Where God create in His own image, and gave you dominion over everything. It is there in the Holy Bible. I am a Muslim. I love Jesus. Are we together, ma? Yes, sir. Feel free. Welcome to the largest family in the whole world. Thank you, sir. Where our love no get on your own. Thank you, sir. Here, we don't discriminate. Thank you, sir. You will be okay. You must be okay by the grace of God Almighty. Amen. Amen. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Thank you, sir. God bless you. And that man, we go make and beg you. We go make and write agreement. Anything happen to you for him like this? No, be only him. Him. In Papa still they alive? Yeah, no, nobody. In Mama only, still they alive? No, only sibling. All in siblings go enter trouble. Chebi Una from Anambra? Yes, sir. Which local government? Oka. Oka, Oka South. Which village? Obuno. Obuno? Yes, sir. Him from Obuno? The You from Obuno? The we go where are Mobu? We go where are Obundi Hojo? 
Okay, what I hand you, yes, sir. You know, I need both of them. Yes, sir. You mean, eh, and a man, eh, one less appreciate her. At least she smile. Please come back. She smile, I be she no smile. That is the essence of this place. Yes. Triple doctor. Obundi hojo. Obun sobu. Okay, what I hand neko? Telechi. Ina ni hand neko. Ina ni hand neko. I don't want to drop it here. It's a different type of woman, Mr. President. Nobody type of woman can allow you. I don't talk say nobody type of. Okay, okay, okay. On you go name or two. What's the translation? Translation. <laughs> Nobody can be this. We don't go translate. Nobody can say that. Well, let me say you are. You are translate a child before you translate. Yes, but I pray. Even if you don't protest. <laughs> you thought that they go wear a cap. Cap of people will do bad things. Uh, that talks to nobody the type where you wear or the uh, type where I can wear. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Barrister Ogo? Yes, sir. You've been in the talks on Twitter. I said we get different types of Okuna uh, consultants, Ike, for tell us. Okay, but I'm going to mention it. I'm going to mention it. I'm going to mention it. The Anne Ekwe Ekwe Anne Eme. The voice of the voiceless. Hey, Chineke. Original. I'm going to mention it because I'm going to mention it. Original. No, this one is fake. No. No. No, I, I, no other. Give us different types of opus. Yeah. Ordinary present to Opu Day. Opu Day. Opu Day. Hey, hey! 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 Uh, but the one where you wear, uh, no be the one where they go wear. Now, this one now, Ubundi Ugu. Ubundi uh, Nebishinala. Uh, uh, mm. uh, but no Ubundi Oma. Mm, okay. Mm. So mm. the one where we go wear them, when we wear them, Aye. you go try make it remove You them. not go fit Komotam. You go be and make the Komotam skin. Mm. I don't know whether you don't notice this kind of headache or migraine where they do person. He waiting you go the wish, we say, make them remove the head. They are kind of migraine way. If you do leg like this, you go feel them. Mm -hmm. More to pass near you, you go feel them. You do, you you they fear to cough. Mm, doctor won't touch your head. Say like this side. You say ah, no 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 no. You they urinate the vibration of the urine. They enter your head. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Make we appreciate. <laughs> the reason behind going. A little bit on serious is because we want to douse the tension in the studio. Mm. This is where we cry with people, we mm. laugh with people. <coughs> and the major target is more laughter than cry. Are we together? Yes. And sh we we succeeded in making her smile before she left the place. Please, let's put our hands together for us. <laughs> uh, hello, Your Excellency Distinguished Ambassador Potopoto, the Brekete family ambassador in the whole of France. Good morning, Your Excellency. Good morning, the triple doctor plus one. Mm. You see, taking care of souls that is not of your lineage, I pray God will continue to Keep you and bless you. Amen. Amen. Ordinarily, because of this uh, system failure in our society, you are showed you a lot. You can't be like a lawyer where secure bail for a foster and told him not to plead guilty. Hmm. You don't declare, they go to the police to arrest, to arrest the client because he pay and would take a lot. <laughs> oh. Okay. Hey, butter, butter. Mm. Yes. And the, our Nigerians are back. You see, we wear the people where they call wife cheap names like honey and sugar. How much sugar be? How much honey be? When they turn the column poor, cement or has 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 school. School fees. School fees. House rent. Mm. House rent today. Uh, thank because you. Because the thing don't pass. 
<laughs> thank you very much. Thank you. I say thank you so much. Just now, I talk to you later. And you talk to now only a Kada man. They fit carrying girlfriend, pass in wife Probably and children, that. and in wife uh, children go tell her bye bye daddy go where. <laughs> Only a kind of man go fit carrying girlfriend with confidence for back. Pass in the front of his house and his wife and children go wave and save Johnny. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because it yeah. is a passenger. My brothers, my sisters, if I look down and I see time done, they give us signal, signal to do things, signal make we continue to the van, not they go. I see the missed call of our break at a family ambassador in Dubai. Make we hear waiting you get to contribute. Today we go give opportunity to all our ambassadors all over the world to call in. The ones in China, the one in Russia, the one all of them. Your Excellency, distinguished Ambassador Chuku, the demand we know they like Chuku Chuku, the defender of the women's race. Good morning, sir. I did request waiting be your contributor. We are Number one is, I want to say, may God richly bless you Amen. and Amen. reward you for what you do for humanity. Amen. Uh, for the steps you are taking to restore this, our sister back. And I want to make something very clear. Marriage can be sweet. But the test of marriage is when there's a problem. The way you handle your partner, mm. the time of child, mm. is what shows whether you truly love that person or not. I've been saying this over and over again. Women should be treated right. Mm. They will be treated right. She is your wife. She's not your slave. You married her to love her, to care for her, to protect her, to be there with her. Not to treat her like a slave. Because maybe she's from a poor home. She has no one to speak for her. Mm -hmm. Women should be respected. Women should be respected. No, must be respected. Should. No, see, must. Saying, must. Must. Replace that must. should. Must. Women must be respected. Yes, sir. Every time I speak about this, some people pick offense. I told them, don't pick offense. Put these women in your position. No. You came to this lady. Oh, that's she agreed to marry you. She agreed to marry you. And suddenly she had this problem. She become an outcast. You. Uh, you can even have the God to, to if stop her from seeing her children. It's the children she carried in her womb for nine months. Your, your Excellency. God. Your Excellency. God. God. Are you not an Igbo man? Ah, confirm Igbo man. Now, make I tell you, from the statistics of the cases where we they get here, majority of Igbo men no get respect for their wives. They believe they did their wives a favor by marrying them. Anybody that has a counter narrative should come and challenge me here. We have, in fact, um, Kemi, enter my office. You and Jessica, bring letters of complaints. They want the first and second set. Make when I bring them here, where I study. Make when I see waiting Igbo men, they do their wives. And anybody where they complain, say why you, they talk, say women must be respected, is a product of, of a useless father. His father was beating his mother. Yes, sir. That is the reason why yes, he, he is not seeing anything wrong in, doing in that. turning his wife to a punching bag or any woman for that matter. Yes, sir. He is a product of a useless, irresponsible, patapatious father. Mm. Now sure make I she... even tell you, make I shock you. This thing happened to her as a result of giving birth. Nine triggered this thing. You know, say you get some kind of complication where they happen during pregnancy where women um abdomen i'll be waiting to record this place where they before area before area one uh -huh. you go the heavy them i be i never carry belay before but i don't give me belay many times 
Uh, I never give bele before. You don't give. Plenty bele where I don't give. Uh, hey, 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 hey. To give bele the sweet. Uh, uh, now the name is ceremony. Uh, okay, Ordinary. just leave this one. This, this, this man, he like, let me correct one impression. Not every Igbo man their wives. Based on our statistics here, majority of Igbo men know, re, do, do, know they respect their wives. Okay, count me out. Count me out. Uh, hey, uh, count you they are among the ma minority. Uh, 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 sir, please, we need this man to explain to us what this woman did to him that will make him first. Carry motor uh, to hit her for, if it was, uh, it was uh, not been because of nakedness. You should come out the clothes, you go you see how the bone shoot out mm -hmm. for her back. Mm -hmm. Thank you, I thank you, sir. May God bless you, sir. Amen. Amen. And you too, sir. Thank you. Thank you. you. Thank you. Yes, Elder. Good morning, my ordinary president. Yeah, don't forget to say Elder and Igbo man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a Nigerian. Oh, okay. Uh, I just want to uh, re re uh, recall something she said mm. while she was talking. Mm. It's like in Igbo language, mm. they say "onyo mm. sotubanilo obanabia obenia," meaning to say, if something is pushing you outside, you have to run back to your home. Mm. But it happened. She said something here that her own siblings, who are well to do, because that is where I'm paying attention, mm. who are well to do, send her back. And say that unless she go back to that same man that is dealing with her, that they are not ready to assist her. Mm. I, I, in fact, my brain is just doing me anyhow because I don't understand why somebody you have somebody, and you say it should go where they are going to kill her before you help. So maybe when they kill her, then he can now go and help dead body. I don't understand. No. Give it to them. Let them play. Mm. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Okay. <coughs> Wait, which number? <coughs> yes, ma'am. Yes. Yes, yes. So now everything where I do and go do. Okay. Make we play for one minute. Where are you? Where you? In Lagada Mandam Boy and Amanda. Lagada Mandam Boy. See who are your people. As I decrease, now so uh, we now follow me decrease. Instead, we will now go tie me rope. Say this one done, they lose control. Uh, now so madness, they take start. Oh. Hello, good morning. Good morning. Yes, you are live oh, on air. President. As me and you follow the talk now. Introduce yourself, sir. <laughs> my own president, I'm Doctor Vasio Kusin. And now you be the disease control and immunization at NPHCD. No, nice talk to see her from my honorary president again. <laughs> Reintroduce yourself, sir. Okay, my honorary president, Brigade family, Nigerians, I'm Dr. Basi Basi Okosin, the director of disease control and elimination at National Primary Care Development Agency. Okay. Yesterday, me and you followed talk. Thank you for your time yesterday. I know you were busy in the afternoon when we spoke, mm. but you had time to speak with me. Mm. I appreciate You can't send me a message whether you go come. No, if, okay, in the night, I sent a message that I did not hear from you again on our request and was asking, please, when would it be possible for us for to be able to meet you? Should be you talk, say, you they follow the program. Yeah, I follow the program. And you, sabi, and you sabi when we they start the program and when we they normally end the program. I know very, very you well. You see my reply see. of yes, please, Abi, you know, yeah. Siam. No, I have. It is this morning that 
because I left the office at about 11 the night yesterday. I did not see the fly. Immediately I came back and I had to pray and sleep. And then this morning, I was showering to get out to the office. And immediately I came out, I saw your message as I'm um, miss call at 6.55. I called by immediately. I heard you were thinking the anthem day to start the We're program. still there for studio. Come yes, to I the know. studio. I Introduce yourself or get they go usher you in if you come before the end of the program. Thank you. Okay. My honor president, thank you very much. Mention, mention. Mention. Thank you. Now not be pretender, mention. <laughs> now an average African or Nigerian, you tell and thank you, you say don't mention. Now it do you good, you are capable. You say what kind of an ungrateful okay. human being? Even come on, thank you. You can not talk. Yesterday I tell you thank you. You say don't mention. Why should I mention again? Now mention. Yes. <laughs> are we together? <laughs> we should stop pretending. My brothers, my sisters, if when I looked at and I said, say, time done, they give us signal, signal to do things, signal make we continue to devour, not they go. This immunization, a, a vaccine matter, now very serious matter. Now I make, we go suspend some cases, make we give priority to this vaccine matter. And thank God say, the executive, uh, the mandate secretary, health and environment, young, energetic lady, we carry um, passion they do her work. From my conversation with her yesterday, I see say this na person when be say if you reach me she carry digger to dig ground for her to deliver her mandate, she did ready to do it. Make we appreciate her. <laughs> but that one no means say we no go ask government question. No be everything we government carry come, now we go accept. We are human beings. We have the right to criticize, to analyze, to even weigh what the government is bringing to us. No be goat we be. No be animals we be. Where one shepherd go just enter, when he say, <coughs> they go this direction, no. Some of us, people like us, when other people they go this direction, we we'll go ask ourselves, why are they going this way? Then we will go this way. While we are going this way, we are asking questions. If you are able to convince us, we join them. If you are not able to convince us, we convince other people to join us on this side. That is our role in the society. We will not be those kind of people waiting they give money as media houses wait and they blow trumpet. We know they do praise singing. You do well, we talk them. You know do well, we go still talk them. The highest way government go do now to close down the station, that is not the end of the, the matter. We are, the angle where we go come off from, aye. What you will know if you talk for radio, now that time we go naked them because there, nobody go regulate us. Nigeria must be better than it is, whether they like it or not, by the grace of God. Amen. We are not after anybody's downfall. But if they put you for office and you know they do well, leave the office. You are one of the people suffocating Nigeria. Let the poor breathe. Don't suffocate them. Let's appreciate Baba Jari. And the way you pronounce the word breathe. Now, the first time way somebody go pronounce the word breathe, where, where I go hear and clearly let the poor breathe. I say, hey, Baba, don't come. Make we appreciate ourselves. Mm. My brothers, my sisters, if I look down and I say, say, time done, they give us signal, signal to do things. Signal, make we invite the mandate secretary and one other person to come sit down for this uh, lower chair. When I for mic them now. Oh. Hmm? Aye. No, don't worry. Sit down. The person we suppose mic them, no mic them. Okay. Now who him be? 
He come late. Hey, you know keep her outside. Person, they come late here. If Nadia, you talk to me on the... Yeah? Ordinary president, you know how civil service be. If it go, give them queries. Hey, so if you give them queries... Make we say, Nadem with the do favor, not be him. Make you no go give them query. Ogaranya. Yes, sir. Ogaranya. Yes, sir. We have our rules here. Uh, ordinary president. Now, this one, so... Ogaranya, please. He is not Oga over the mandate secretary, if you, in case you don't know. Mm. Even in Oga... Wait. Even in Oga, this man Oga, mm. and this man Oga Oga, mm. and this man Oga Oga Oga, mm. raised mm. to power seven, they are under the mandate secretary. <laughs> ah, wait. For them to give a woman mandate secretary, hmm. man, date secretary. Hey, uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I hope nobody this now man. Now, woman, where they equivalent to men, they, they give mandate secretary. Hmm. Make we appreciate her. Uh -uh. My brothers, my sisters, if I looked at an assistant, time, they give us signal, signal to do it in signal, make we continue to deliver, not they go. Sorry, no vex. So. Uh -huh. So, um, when I remember what I talked yesterday, when I remember now, yes, you make we hear from the government side. If this thing good for us, we go know. If you know good for us, we go know. Our own be say, we go present them. As he be say, no be by force for you to take the vaccine. But you go take your common sense. Read in between the lines, okay. This thing, true, true, if they kill these people. This, this, okay. And I know what makes this sickness catch me. I don't know what I want to understand. That is if you are convinced, ladies and gentlemen, the mandate secretary go introduce herself, and the person will follow him, go introduce. And then some other team members, where they decide, they go follow, introduce themselves properly. Over to you, mandate secretary. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, viewers at please, home. Please sit down. Thank you. Mm. My name is Dolapo Fashawe. I'm the Mandate Secretary for Health and Environmental Services, SCT. <laughs> Madam, carry your microphone. Madam, carry my... Okay, okay. No, go ahead, go ahead. Okay. Good morning, ordinary president. Mm. Good morning, viewers. Nigerians. I'm Dr. Chizoba Wonodi. I am a faculty member at the Johns Hopkins School of Public Health in Baltimore, but I also work and support the National Primary Health Care Development Agency here in Nigeria. Thank you very much. Yeah. The ordinary president, Sam. Let me also add my voice. May God bless you for what you are doing. Amen. Right. And you too, sir. My name is Dr. <clears throat> Lubin Gabelo. I'm the acting director general, FCT Hospitals Management Board. Aha. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Hey, now, thank God, say you come. Yeah. Any case where concern any hospital where they're under FCT, FCT. see the person will go who responsible. Yes. yes. If we report to Rami, no take action. We will take action against her. Good idea, yes? Yes. Thank you, sir. Uh, good morning, ordinary president. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, my name is Dr. Ruka Yawamoku. I'm director of primary health care and community service for FCT Primary Health Care Board. Thank you. Which person phone be that phone wearing? May that person no ever, ever come back to the studio again. Thank you. So, Monday Secretary Ma. Yes, sir. We Nami Toka on behalf of Nigerians, waiting Nigerians they cry out. Talk say this vaccine it get side effect. We go come out where they no tell anybody. Why? Because Nigeria are dumping ground for any experiment where they want to do, both for food, for drug, even for electronics. 
Now, Nigeria be the dumping ground because of weak pol government policies where we get. We are the government policy they strong. The individuals that are supposed to be responsible on behalf of the government have been compromised. Nigeria and our country, when we say, they will not even get the capacity to reanalyze the content of the vaccines when they enter Nigeria because how many standard labs we get for Nigeria? If you know any, mention which equipment and which equipment they did. Which year they produced the equipment? You go carry obsolete equipment, they test virus, we don't mutate, change pattern. We old machine know the few see the mutation. Newer machines don't they detect them, but this one you go ignore them because in eye, no day intelligent enough to see the sickness. Now here we there for Nigeria, Pfizer carry vaccine. Oh, Hajia, I never send you that one, but I know go. Pfizer carry vaccine, go cano, give people children. People die in their hundreds. Nothing happened. And as we they talk, some children even talk say they first them collect vaccine uh, last week, this week, three days ago from school. And he get video where I received from Bauchi, Kasena, Kano, and uh, which state be that? Where children, but now how sad language they take the lady complain. Women they talk say since we then give this their their daughter that vaccine for school. Now the daughter know, know well again. She lie down. Some of them, they interview the children. After some days, the children die. But the video is still there. This is not something where person, person feel go very far. But I don't know which vaccine it be. If it be say no be the one way government approve. If it be say uh, na enemies of this country follow back in order to give ba vaccine bad name. We don't know, but we will go verify. We not go know. When the Pfizer own happen, when they carry the matter go court, the defense way Pfizer get be say the parents don't consent. They give you paper, make you sign. Some parents go sign without reading. Some no even go school. Now some children, their children uh, then go come back and tell their parents say then give them one vaccine. The parents know they are aware. My fear now make waiting happen for Kano no repeat himself. <clears throat> we make waiting I see for that video, those videos where they happen for not, no repeat themselves. We don't know the source of those vaccines. We don't know which waiting they claim say it they work for. But this one where they tell us say government carry come. Nahin with a question. So and thank God the authority them. Now then they for studio. One other authority they come from National Primary Healthcare Development Agency. When we say him be they in charge of uh, vaccine and uh, something disease control. I've been waiting he talk him that time. He did not say I no go to school for over ten years. He did for road they come. So now we go listen to the mandate secretary and her team. The reason behind bringing the team is when leader they talk, people will they support the leader. If they identify any area where the leader just no shed more, uh, enough light on top, them go follow, explain. That is the best thing that can happen to any leader for you to have efficient people around you over to you ma. thank you very much sir and um, it's an absolute delight and pleasure to be here i haven't heard of this radio station before but um since yesterday and today from my review online listening and being here today i can comfortably say that the day you die is the day you stop learning mm. i have learned a lot today 
And like you said, <laughs> before opening, any leader who stops reading or learning, you're as good as dead. I told him last night that I will not come here alone. I will come with people who know more than me, who have done more research than me, but I will come here to say what I know. And I appreciate this opportunity. But before we go on, I'd like to talk to the case of our young lady there. Mm. <coughs> the mandate of this government is renewed hope. In FCT, we have a scheme, health insurance scheme. I want to announce here today that we will be supporting the people's president by registering this lady hmm. on our health insurance. Oh. And this scheme allows you a full year of health treatment free of charge. <laughs> In addition to what he has done, we will renew it next year. Your condition may, is something we call chronic. It won't go away in one day. You will need constant care. And that's the essence of health insurance. And I heard him say something. Health insurance is a situation where the, all of us put money together, the rich, uh, the middle class, to take care of people like you that we call vulnerable. You will be registered for free, for nothing. And I can assure you that the mandate secretary for transport will take over this case and fish out your husband. And I don't know about um, soft copy, <laughs> but the, the hands of the law, a lawyer is here, mm. we will do the right thing. Oh, <laughs> mm. Now, going to this vaccine, first of all, I want to say, that this vaccine has been used for over 16 years. <laughs> Even in Nigeria, but in the private sector, where it is very expensive, it is not affordable. And for some of us who have had children abroad, we have vaccinated our children. Now, why do we take immunization? Why do we take vaccines? Let's leave this one aside for a minute. Women, when we have children, they come, drop something in their hand, mouth. A lot of us, if we look here, we have that mark of BCG. From time immemorial, it has been proven that immunization helps your body create substances that will fight against that disease. A typical example is polio. Nigeria has now been declared polio-free. If you remember, for the adults and elders here, when we were growing up, we had a lot of people who walked with a funny kind of limp. Children of the rich, children of the poor, just because they were not vaccinated. That situation, that sight, is rapidly becoming a thing of the past. And this is due to the success of campaigns like has to do with reproduction. It's transmitted sexually. Men carry the virus. Women carry the virus. But if this virus is left there, so I'm a health promoter. I believe in preventing diseases before thinking of treating diseases. In health promotion, what we do is we educate people. We, like he has given us an opportunity to do. He said to me yesterday that I should come and make my point. He will make his point. And we both agreed, which I very, very much like, that let people make informed choices. Informed choices means people make informed choices. Informed choices means you have heard both sides of the argument. The vaccines are not given by force. The vaccines are not given by coercion. We don't even give incentives. It is your decision to take it. 
it has been found out that it is most efficient when we give it between the ages of 9 to 14 years old. And this is just simple. This is when the hormones and the reproductive organs and the reproduction of these our young ladies start to act up. And in this part of the world especially, and in this part of Nigeria, we see that cancer of the cervix is high. And this is attributed to early sexual intercourse, early transmission of the disease, people not even knowing signs and symptoms and when to get treatment. I'm happy to say cervical cancer is one of the most treatable, if caught early, cancers in the whole world. And I am saying, I don't even want to catch it early. We want to prevent it. There's a vaccine the government has. We, yes, we got donations. We got support from international agencies. However, the government has made a lot of investments in logistics to ensure that this vaccine reaches every single local government of this country. A lot of money, a lot of manpower, a lot of time, even getting the parents, even being here. We both didn't live here till like past 11 p.m. yesterday. And being back here at 7 a.m., to talk about it again, time is money. I will just close by saying there are clinical trials where we will try something out to see if it is safe. Unfortunately, what happened in Kano was a trial. This vaccine has gone through trials from over <coughs> up to 20 years ago and has been certified safe both by American Drug and Food Association and our own NAFDAC. NAFDAC certified it safe. NAFDAC approved that our children and our young girls be given this vaccine because in 2020, 80,000 people died of cervical cancer. This vaccine has been proven to reduce the possibility of catching cervical cancer by 92%. If we remove 92% of 80,000 people, that means we're having maybe only 60-something people dying in a year. And if we leave this thing unattacked, how many people did we calculate die daily from, from, from? By the end of today, 22 women would have died from cervical cancer at the rate it happens in Nigeria. 22 women every day. Every day. And the good news is we have discovered this vaccine that can prevent it. I implore this house, like he said, let us read. Let us seek for knowledge and take informed decisions. And um, <coughs> once again, I'm grateful for this opportunity to come and talk here because I am also seeing this studio as a very, very, very strong tool in advocating for so many other things. He said it, that women are precious. Women should be taken care of. We are saying the mandate that our gov president, President Bola Metinubo, and the minister of FCT has said, no woman should die at childbirth again. It is not acceptable. It will not happen. And how do we achieve this? It's by advocacy, coming to stations like this, to talk, to beg, to say, come for antenatal care. Let's all, there's no reason for a woman to die at childbirth as long as you have access to basic primary health care. Thank you very much again, sir. And I'll leave the floor to you. Yes, you get anything to add? I'll be we hear from uh, Dr. Okay. Give, give a microphone. You get? I can, yes, I have okay, something to have add, something sir. Before Dr. Biello. Okay. Thank you, Honorable President. Ordinary. <laughs> Ordinary <laughs> President. <laughs> before okay. you go talk, ma, uh, Princess Zesh, say what is done. Okay, no, not Princess. 
Uh, Oluk Ayode Gabriel, he said Tinubu appoints a lot of people we get sense. See the difference bet be be between before and now. The hope is looking renewed small, small. Mm -hmm. The Monday secretary shall be her work. <clears throat> Make we appreciate. <clears throat> and then Princess Zesh say, what is done here in UK is a letter of acceptance. It will be sent to the parent asking parental permission for your children to take the vaccine and explanation is given why okay. over there in the UK. Okay. So over to you, Ma. Thank you so much, sir. Um, the mandate secretary has said pretty much everything, but I want to add that this vaccine has been available in the US since 2006. I have two daughters. One is 26, one is 24. When they were younger, when they were teenagers, I gave them the vaccine. I took them to give them the vaccine. At that time, it was not available in Nigeria. It later became available in Nigeria, but in the private sector. And the parents who have the money, who know about it, go to a clinic and they get it for between 40,000 Naira or maybe 25,000 Naira. Maybe now it has come down to 25,000 Naira a dose. But the majority of girls in Nigeria did not, could not get it. Their parents could not afford it. Their parents may not even have known about it. So now the government is introducing it in the immunization program. Vaccine is something that we are used to. We've been giving children vaccine for a long time. And vaccine has made some diseases disappear that we don't even remember again. I remember when I was in medical school, they taught us about neonatal tetanus, which is tetanus that catches a, a newborn child. Because of vaccination, you can hardly see neonatal tetanus. So you can go through medical school and you will never see a case of neonatal tetanus because of vaccination. In preg of pregnant women. Now, this vaccine is targeted at cervical cancer. There are so many cancers, as we know. But cervical cancer has a unique property. Number one is one of the cancers that we know the cause of. We know that is infection by this HPV uh, virus. We know that. Another cancer that we know what causes it is, uh, the infection that causes it is hepatitis, hepatitis B. Unfortunately, my father died from it. But there is a vaccine for it now. And because of the vaccination of, you know, with hepatitis B uh, uh, vaccine, the incidence of hepatitis B cancer has gone down. In the UK, where they started vaccinating with this HPV vaccine, for more than 12 years now, cervical cancer incidence has gone down by more than 87%. So the value of this vaccine is very clear. It has been demonstrated in many countries. It is effective, it is safe, and then it's also cost effective. Why do I mean cost effective? The cost to treat one cancer is much, 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 much higher than the cost of the vaccination. So that's why vaccination programs are good public health interventions. Thank you. I know people may have concerns, but the MPHCDA, who is leading this process of introducing this vaccine, has many um, information that they've put out. There are short videos. There is a, there is a toll-free number, I think it's 770 or so, that people can call. And then even in the communities, the healthcare workers and civil society organizations are educating the parents, the yeah, teachers, and all that. It's not, like the secretary said, it's not mandatory. In fact, there is a study that MPHCDA did last week they interviewed over 16,000 people across Nigeria. And they were asking them, this HPV vaccine, if 
is available to you. Will you take it or will you allow your child to take it? And they told them that it prevents cervical cancer. Nine, more than 90%, in fact, 92% of the people said, yes, we will take it. That is because they understand the value of the vaccine. They understand that it is something that is preventing cancer. <clears throat> and to add to what she has said, statistics have showed us in FCT, since this program began, we have vaccinated over 60,000 ladies. And out of these 60,000, it is my duty to tell the truth. We have had one, just single one, girl react by pain and redness on her finger from this vaccination. Shoulder. On her shoulder, sorry, not her finger. Pain, redness, and difficulty, which with Panadol, we have been able to treat. I am very, very happy to see someone come out here and say, since I took this vaccine, my life has not remained the same. And if that's the case, there are some things called comorbidities. People may have other diseases. And it may just happen that it is the day you take the vaccine that that other disease decides to materialize. There may not be any connection at all. The only scientific connection we have had to the vaccine is only one out of 60,000. And I believe that that is enough to encourage us to bring our daughters out, our sisters, and our friends to take this vaccine. Thank, Thank you. you. <clears throat> now, we will still uh, listen to other people. We will open telephone line. But you see, for other parts of the world, like areas we will not mention, before then they roll out vaccines like this. Then they take blood samples of different blood groups to understand how this particular blood group, if things being equal, everything normal, how this particular blood group will react to this vaccine. No be one cap fits all. We go come back to that one. Dr. Obielu, Yes. over to you. Sir. Yeah, thank you, ordinary president. Uh, when you are being introduced, we are told that you are a double doctor. <clears throat> and then we know that, plus one. And then we know that the aim of this organization is to promote <clears throat> and protect people's rights. And health is also part of that right. So what we are doing as the health sector in the FCT is actually, like my Monday secretary said, health promotion. See, prevention is always cheaper and better than cure. Like it has been said, this vaccine has been existing for about 16 years. And they have studied that they had even followed people for up to 12 years and no serious or major untowards reaction to this. But do you know that you people in Nigeria within the health sector yes, <clears throat> can be used ignorantly? Now, make I tell you something, Dr. Bello. Yes, sir. How many standard labs do we have in Nigeria? Let's start with Abuja. I know we have one standard lab in Lagos. But Nigeria has 36, 37 states, yeah. FCT inclusive. How many states get standard labo, la, uh, la, uh, laboratories? How many? Standard, world class. Not be queer, queer. Not be the one uh, when we say the machine. Now top notch as at 2018, 2016. The machine is still they new. But the machine has been phased out because new one machines don't come out. We don't phase that one out because of ongoing studies where they do, they discover, say, 
he gets some kind things where it don't happen to that particular virus when we say it don't change pattern now before it they go like this but now it can't they go like this and this old machine no fit identify the one now only the, the one will go like this i don't know whether my example you know say even double doctor triple doctor where they here you don't know if you know whether a native doctor or my <laughs> doctor <laughs> you understand yeah. but yeah. our own be say we want they sure if they can send useless educational curriculum to nigeria to africa they can send any useless thing to africa and the one thing we we even trigger my defense first of all now the 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 the, the donor of the vaccine bill and melinda gate foundation this now bill gateway they complain about africa's pop, uh, population every time when you talk may they reduce our population may they reduce our population then this kind of person can send something to africa we go check and first if it be say he carry good intention if it be say he carry nyama nyama intention at the background where you na no know. Now only a few people go know and they go don't buy them over. Yes. Una they convinced beyond every reasonable doubt. If Una know how the Monday secretary talked yesterday, she said she's not just sure. She is more than sure. This woman is more than convinced that this thing is good for Nigerians. And that is the reason why she is pushing it. Yes. Not because she has any ulterior motive. I want to make you understand. But you get the way they can, they go use your mother against you without your mother knowing that she is being used against you. I don't know whether I want to understand. Yes. So make we try to understand that this program what they do now to naked matter. No pant, no bra. Make people understand. Anybody where they do bleaching, where they do bleaching, where yellow, where where, you know, if you understand whether I bleaching, I will not be bleaching apart from body odor. Allow the person to sleep for night. When the dumb person sleep, on light. If na man, drop in trousers more, open in between the bum bum. Cream, no, they enter there. You go see. You go see the person recall. Hey, Dr. Bello. Thank you. Triple doctor. Yeah, my Monday secretary. We okay. want to. Yes. Secretary. So, sir, I am happy you mentioned Lagos. Lagos has a level three biosecurity lab, mm -hmm. which is probably the best in West Africa. Mm -hmm. Make we appreciate Lagos. <laughs> now. Corona was a bad thing, but it also helped us understand exactly what he was talking about, that we need to step up our game in being prepared for unprecedented epidemics. And because of that, the Nigerian Center for Disease Control has a standard lab that other West African countries come to use, and that center is here in Abuja. Yeah. NAFDAQ also, I can certify as a lab, there's something called International Standards Organization. When your lab is ISO certified, it means that any results that that lab gives, before they certify you, <coughs> they will check the technical specification of your equipment to be sure it is not rusty or the old one. It is up to date. Your chemicals are up to date. Your processes. Even the capacity of the doctor doing the test, we will do exams. CDC lab is ISO certified. NAFDAQ lab is ISO certified. This lab in Lagos is ISO certified. And it then means that any test carried out in any of these labs will be acceptable worldwide. It also means that anything that comes into our country, NAFDAQ has been known to reject and burn Tons of medication. NAFDAQ has been known to reject and burn tons of medication because they do not pass the standard test for human consumption. We, Nigeria is changing. We are not a dumping ground anymore. 
we are not even accepting grants that are not useful to us anymore. We are saying, give us what we need to do what we want to do, not what you have money to give us for. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I think my Monday secretary has said it all, you know. And actually, the lab also depends on exactly what you are looking for, what organism you are looking for. There are special labs for, some, for special conditions. But by and large, she had summarized it. Nigeria, and indeed Abuja, has standard labs that is ISO, ISO certified. Somebody tell okay. me, say, the way you get, give bribe, make you get NAVDAC uh, number and license. Now, so you feel give bribe to get ISO number. See, it good as you now tell us now, these are verifiable facts. We go find out. Nigeria is too big to have only two or three standard labs. With the kind of population we have, the kind of money we have, the kind of prospects we have. I was so ashamed of myself when they took sample from Nigeria to Kenya. I was so ashamed of myself that the then Minister of Health could say in the public, sit down there first. Give a chair for a back seat first. Make you sit down. Minister of Health go to say, he no no say, na so condition of hospitals for Nigeria be. A Minister of Health, when the, that day, that day, nice president supposed to slap him out of the office. It means you don't even know why you are there. Why when I see, say they upgrade some hospitals now? Because big men, Corona help us. It help us reduce some people who we, we destroy this country. <laughs> now, when big men we suppose encourage make good things happen for within our health sector, no greed do. Now when they just wake up, they go rush them. Uh, government hospital where they nearby. Brrr, this is uh, uh, ambassador. This, this uh, they say uh, uh, we uh, the area enter. Uh, they bring oxygen. Oh, that oxygen no they work since. <laughs> but, 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 they, uh, you know say when they work they do pro 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 pro. This one go do brrr, 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 brrr. They go sir. As we uh, speak now, the 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 this thing. Me, me, me. They don't go another hospital. They don't. Oh, oh ambassador is coming. Uh, senator is coming. Uh, member House of Reps is coming. Uh, former minister is coming. They cope. Before they go, go three to four hospitals. You don't buy me. Now, when big men, she say, at that time, to aeroplane, no, they fly, go any country, anyhow. Hey, hey, that is with us. As we did trap for Nigeria, and so God trapped them with us. Hospitals where they, they take, they kill our family members, the same hospitals too. They can't they die inside. The one where they pay me now, the way then they carry big men, come bury for burial ground where, where poor men they. That thing they pay me. That thing they pay me. So, now that time they begin by, uh, when I remember, yes, sir. They, 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 the director of public uh, waiting, waiting, uh, NMPC, come call me one day. Hello, ordinary president. Ah, my senior brother, I greet and finish. He say, are you aware that we have uh, donated uh, what the, what the, what the pool for Corona people? Ventilator, Ventilator to Guagala uh, Datichi <laughs> Hospital. We have donated social number. <laughs> It is a now, uh, better person they talk to. Now I tell and say, why will I no donate them since? <laughs> now when I see, say, when our guys don't, they die one by one. <laughs> they go, now go put them where, uh, when I go carry them, rush, you go. And if poor man, they on top, they go discharge and come out and put them for big man. Mm -hmm. I say, NMPC, no try. 
And if you want to disgrace your yourself, come to the studio, make me and you discuss her. Till today, you know the answer, my colleague. I don't know whether I will understand. But the truth is, make we not take ignorance. Can't ignore what will save our lives. Mm -mm. Ours is to present it to you, both left and right. It is up to you now to make an informed choice. This time around, now you decide. Not be waiting ordinary president talk. Not be waiting them talk. Now you decide. You don't see the advantage. I don't know whether I will understand though. One of our, 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 our guys will enter now. Once we create space for him, where he goes to do, into go adding voice to him. Meanwhile, after the talk finish, we go open telephone line. And I want to tell you, I say, the first thing will trigger my defense. Now the fact say that Bill and Melinda Gate donator. Now, for this um, this one where professors can't attack me that time. What will we do for two weeks? GMO. For GMO. 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 You get one group where they call Monsanto. Yes, sir. Very deadly in the world. Monsanto is so connected that is they are deep into Nigeria. They have they have bought over journalists. They have bought over health workers. They have bought over some civil society organizations. Monsanto. Go and investigate Monsanto. For you to know how deadly they are to the world. So, just if I wake up one day and say, I hear say Monsanto donate agri materials because them now within the agricultural sector, then they enter. You can imagine one person wake up and say, You won't donate mosquito to Nigeria. We go kill our own mosquito because it decreases. When I know he, when I never hear him, when I never hear him, okay. say then go donate mosquito. The la, laboratory fabricated mosquitoes into Nigeria, we go kill our own mosquito. Now ask yourself, after they kill our mosquito, what did they go do? Kill <laughs> One man start tomato business. That year where he start tomato business. Tomato farmers suffer loss because tomato can't they die up and down, but you own tomato, no die. In Nigeria here. Now back to the studio. Um Adia, you get anything where you want to add? Yes. Yes, ma'am. Uh, I'm sorry for my voice. No, uh, your voice is good. Only I'm say having Monday code. secretary voice to mine is to mine as part of my job is to advocate, communicate and socially mobilize in the community. And I'm advocating today in this very noble radio station for our women. Because this thing is affecting our women. It's the women that is mostly affected. And prevention is better than cure. And the whole world is moving into preventive medicine, not curative. I'm advocating for you and accept this free, safe vaccine for our young girls that are going to be our leaders tomorrow. We want them to survive. We want to increase our indices to a good one. Nigeria, we are giant of Africa, and we should be giant in good indices. The data is showing that cervical cancer is killing most of our women in Nigeria, in Africa as a whole. And now something is, has come, a vaccine. We should accept it. And then this vaccine, there are some rumors all over about the vaccine. I remember a rumors, some rumors about folio vaccine that 
I believe some of us here, including myself, we are all vaccinated with oral polio vaccine. And I have children. And I know that most of you here, women, are vaccinated. And we also have children. So you now weigh and look at it. It is free and safe. And Nigeria is no longer a dumping ground. We have all the equipment, we have all the power, we have the energy, we have the strength, we have the manpower, we have the knowledgeable people that can take care and scrutinize this vaccine and found it safe okay. for our people in Nigeria. Thank you. If you go abroad, it's also Nigerian people that are taking care of their hospitals. And you are all aware that Nigerians are leaving country to go there. And they take care of their hospital. And whosoever leave Nigeria, leave our hospitals, leave our facilities to go abroad for, for cure. When you go there, it's Nigerians that receive you. It's Nigerians that take care of you. Thank we are you. intelligent people. Thank you so much. You see, beautiful presentation. But make I tell you now something. When I know say the CNN no na they watch for Nigeria no be the same CNN where Americans they watch. When I know I be when I know no. We don't know. Even drugs where they they carry come. No be the same efficacy he get with the ones where they there. Now make some pharmacies if you go. The same medicine they go tell you say make you wait. There are drugs they come from abroad. Why? The same name, the same everything. The one where then they ship to Africa, the line they different. If the line no they different, they go don't produce the ones for America, Europe, and other places where they believe say no more human beings they. Then they go, they go re reduce the standard by producing the ones they are going to send to Africa. In case we don't know, we know. But make we open telephone line. For those of us away there for Nigeria, the number to call now. Okay, ah, he still remind me. He stand up, make I see in height. Is he say we won by passa? Uh, put in your here. Uh, sorry, <laughs> sit down here. This one, not stand up. Sit down. It means I don't prepare for you. <laughs> okay, uh, please, sir. Welcome, sir. Thank you. Introduce yourself. Take the microphone close to your I mouth. I beg before I introduce. Embe, Embe. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Maybe soft dance was <laughs> well. <laughs> My name is Dr. Basi, okay. Basi Okposen. Mm. Uh, by the grace of God, I may be Director of Disease Control and Immunization for NPHCDA. Which one be NPHCDA? National Primary Health Care Development Agency. Eh, eh, moku no clap. <laughs> Over to you, sir. Okay. Shebi, you don't get opportunity here waiting them talk. Add your voice because you two now talk ready you be. Okay. First, honorary president, I want apologize. Say I know no say this meeting go hold today. You know say I for sleep forget the wait. Hey, yeah. Yesterday, you remember I debate say which time we go fit come mm. talk through mm. your platform. Mm. Now, only when I did hear for radio this morning, I you know, say, oh, mm. our people for FCT day. Okay. You know, when Papa day, Mama day, Cousins day, the child feed go, they collect pocket money from everybody. Uh, yes, very true. <laughs> go the worker. So, FCT and the Secretary of Health that are there, the partners that are here, they also had a need to meet with your team and not knowing that we're also making effort. But I think the good thing is, with all your tight schedule, you are giving us time to be able to talk today. This we is appreciate. very important. Thank this you very, very much. Important. Thank you very much. Now, to tell Nigerians, human papilloma virus 
there are about over 200 types of the virus. Now nine types where they cause disease for man. Type 6, 11, 16, 18, 33, 35, 46, 53, and 58. What about the remaining ones? The remaining ones are mainly animals and very minor things that are, doesn't cause very serious problem and doesn't lead to any complication. For cervical cancer, now type 16 and 18, they cause cervical cancer. And we know from our teaching hospitals, tertiary institutions, the documents they have reported every year about 73,619 cases of cancers are reported. Out of these, 12,075 are cervical cancer alone. And out of this number, follow-up shows that 80% die. Literally about 8,020 of them die every year. These are our mothers, our sisters, our aunties, our cousins, and the rest of them. And this is something that would have been prevented. The other aspect is that this cervical cancer that is killing our women, 95% of the cases are caused by infection, infection with human papillomavirus. In other words, if there are 100 women standing here that have cervical cancer, 95 of them got it through human papillomavirus infection. Studies have also shown very clearly, ordinary precedent, that 95% of every adult have at one point or the other in his or her lifetime contracted this infection. The thing is that over 90% will just go <coughs> without any sign. The people will not know. How did they the they ones get you the now know it's through sexual intercourse. Through sexual intercourse. The instance they will come to know that they have a problem is when they have like what? The genital what? Those small black things that appear around the private. Sometimes it increases in size, sometimes it doesn't increase in size, sometimes it, dis it disappears on its own. That is the point that they will know. Oh, and they will just take it as a very simple thing because it doesn't disturb them, it doesn't do anything. About 5 to 10 percent can progress to cervical cancer. The danger is when it starts affecting the cancer, the women will not know until when they start bleeding, when they start having pains, when they are meeting with their spouse and the rest of it, they will now know they have a problem. At that point, the cancer is already spreading. When it's happening like that, it's very difficult at that stage to help the woman because the cancer cells have gone to other parts of the body and the woman will die. This is a situation where we would have just given a vaccine. The woman is not, or the man is protected against infection by the virus and the person lives a healthy life. Now, because most people don't know and they don't take the vaccine, it happens like that and we are losing our people. Anybody that wants to see what cervical cancer can do, go to National Hospital, they will show you the underground world. From the gate, the smell alone you will hear, you will pray it never happens even to your enemy. And this is how these women will just die. Now, the first country to have introduced under the president was US in 2006. UK were the second to introduce in 2008. We in Nigeria, in Africa, Rwanda was the first country to introduce in 2011. They were the first. 2015, 9th, specifically 9th May 2015 was when we submitted our first application to get this vaccine. Nigerians, under president, sir, we've been following up to get this vaccine since May 2015. <coughs> we could not get. I usually know number to be a strength but the case of nigeria each time we talk they will say nigeria is too large we don't have enough quantity for nigeria they were now giving other smaller countries between there and then 2011 and now 11 other african countries have introduced nigeria is the 12th to introduce we now told them last year okay we will not wait for the entire country to introduce at the same time just give us whatever you can give us let us also start and that is when they assigned 6.4 million doses to nigeria and when we look at it, this 6.4 million doses can only go for 15 states and the FCT. They promise next year they will give additional. And I also want, my President sir, and regular family, this vaccine is for both boys and girls. In developed countries that they have the vaccine, <coughs> it's for both. But in Nigeria, because we don't have enough quantity, and because the cases are more in female, that's why we decide to start with the female. 
the age group for the vaccination, if we have enough vaccine, is nine years to 26 years for both boys and girls. Now, having other countries that have been introduced before us and we don't have enough vaccine, what we now needed to do was how do we prioritize so that we reach the most vulnerable? That's how we came down to women, uh, girls 9 to 14 who are not yet exposed because from NDHS, the NDHS data have shown that at 15 years, already about 20% of them have been exposed. So since we are trying to prevent, it's better to give them this vaccine even before they begin to be sexually active, and that is the reason that is given at that age. And studies also show that at a younger age, they respond faster to the vaccine. You know, once they take a single dose, it gives them protection of up to 10, 15, 20 years for a normal response to it. And the human papilloma virus infection, from the point the person contact to when it will cause cancer, sometimes it takes 10, 15, 20 years before it shows up. But in somebody that is immunocompromised, like HIV AIDS patient or other immunocompromised condition, they can get it faster under five years, 10 years of the cancer. So that is the situation now, looking at what others have done. And honorary president, I want to use this for opportunity if you appreciate and allow me. Dr. Juan, she's a Nigerian. She's the head of vaccines in MSD US. She is the one that took a single step, worked with her board of MSD in US to say, since we don't have this vaccine from Gavi to give Nigeria, and we are the one giving MSD, I'm a Nigerian, I must protect my people. That is how they directly allocated the vaccine to Nigeria. But that one, now Libyans they use destroy Libya. In, you see, um, it's good as you educate us. In fact, now, now we even understand, say, the uh, papilloma. But you don't talk Finnish. Okay, I just I want to add this one. Uh -huh, Adam. As this vaccine comes, you know our mama Navdak, DG Navdak, usually there are, only two, there are only two factories or labs in Africa that can assess HPV vi vaccine. The one here, the NAVDAC one at Lagos, and one in South Africa. Those are the only two accredited labs in the African continent. Usually for vaccine and assessment, it takes about four weeks, maximum six weeks, the result is out. Honorary President, this particular one, President, this particular one, NAVDAC look at that vaccine for three and a half months three and a half months before NAVDAC certified it. And Thursday before last, the DG NAVDAC at Transcorp made a press briefing and gave a detail of the analysis they did and why they have approved it. And the Gadaxil we are using, there are so many types of vaccines for HPV, uh, for HPV uh, vaccine. Mm -hmm. The best in the world is Gadaxil, and that is what we are getting for Nigeria. NAVDAC, no day, when um, Pfizer, uh, crisis happen for Ga for Kano. Ogasa, you don't tell away government they lie to us. Now I make we know they trust government easily now until we are convinced beyond reasonable doubt. Not be the first time. And government know they even shame to lie. I don't know whether you understand, sir. Yes. With this okay. education now, we are getting more educated. Many people don't they talk say with this explanation now Somebody talks, say, I will not allow my two daughters to now go and take this vaccine. <laughs> I don't know whether you understand. And then I just see one message now where somebody be like, say, if they threaten me, I be if they try to coerce me. Uh, good morning, ordinary. I'm a trust you. This finds you and your family well. It has come to my attention of a circulating negative statement you made condemning the HPV vaccine that was launched in Nigeria on Tuesday. This statement is currently creating chaos and block refusals of a life-saving vaccine against cervical cancer. I'm very surprised by, by this, considering that we are even airing our radio spot on the vaccine on your radio station. I would be extremely grateful if you could please retract this statement and broadcast the correct information about the vaccine. I'm available for further discussion at your convenience. Kind regards, Mrs. Margaret Adaba Shoyemi. If they like me, then stop the advert. I know even they are aware. 
Brekete family is different from human rights radio and television. Ordinary president is different from them. We are, if, in fact, may they stop the advert, return their money if they don't pay, if not free, we uh, stop them. Over 90% of what we do on, in this station is free of charge. Ask Monday secretary how much we charge her. Ask a primary health care development agency how much we charge. May they try go even the government stations and see how much they will charge them. Now, President, I beg no vex. No, see, I'm not be saying no vex. Somebody go just send <laughs> message without uh, chewing the message. I know, I know. Well, I not I not be passing away then they threaten. I not of all the gifts where God give me, He deny me one, which yeah. is fear. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Another and a correct one. <laughs> Honorary President, so I Mrs. Margaret, show you me. Come, uh, Margaret, come. Margaret Adaba, <laughs> show you me. Come and collect your money if you have paid, including the ones we have played. We are giving you back the money. We don't need it until we are convinced. And this is convincing. You can see people making comments on the YouTube saying they are not convinced. They are ready to send their children i don't know this sitting is dispelling th that fear dispelling yes. that notion yes oh no president i beg no vex no no just answer if i tell you say i know vex now lie i lie i, I vex. beg no vex i beg no vex when yeah. we finish may you flog me on our behalf <laughs> oh you know her <laughs> i think i know the woman one of our partners well, no, President, you remember you asked one question. Mm. I beg my, I just sharply, sharply yeah, answer I'll that one. Quickly. You see, for time of polio, people say those children, they know go come deliver. I know many of them where they deliver now, mm. where they deliver now. Mm. And they cripple people with the sea for street. Plenty, plenty before. As at that time, we started over 33,802 persons were crippled every year. We no see the cripple. The government we won't stop the cripple. We no see the cripples again for road. The time where COVID come, I still remember. You remember we come here. You come give us platform where we talk to Nigeria. How much you not pay? Ha! Ah, not free. Honorary okay. president. Now I call you yesterday. Say we won't come talk again here. Honorary <laughs> <laughs> president. As of today, today with the statistics we have, ninety three thousand six hundred and two, eight hundred and six have received the COVID vaccine in Nigeria. Thank you. And. Now, people say before they start the vaccine that anybody will take the vaccine go go mad. As we come, they give the vaccine, people no go mad. They say after two years, they go die. Yeah. The two years come, six months first. The, the six months pass, people know that they say two years. Now, it's exactly three years and eight months. Okay. 93 million persons have taken the vaccine. Nobody have died uh, from the vaccine. Doctor. Now, the HPV don't come. You know, people don't talk. We they beg them. We go ask question. Okay. Thank you, sir. All okay. right. All right, if President. We, if you they convinced, until we they convinced. Mm -hmm. Now, Chingere Udochi Nwabwani, he said, can a person with hepatitis B in an adult age still take the vaccine and, and where can it be gotten? Okay. I can repeat the question again. I hear the question. Uh, well, well. Say, person will get hepatitis B, we don't be adult fit take the vaccine okay. maybe we have known the age what happens is now adult person wait, wait, wait. okay vaccination is for nine to 26 years after 26 years we only advise that the woman goes for screening every year because she will have been exposed by then now i'm actually linking to they said can they take the vaccine with hepatitis i'm trying to link the equation for the hepatitis and the HPV we are talking about, we are linking the equation. You are asking whether I can take the vaccine. That kind of person can take. There are two different viruses causing two different diseases. In fact, those kind of people are even immunosuppressed because they are not very strong. They don't have enough digestion that it should be. And they're immunocompromised like the HIV. Those are okay. the kind of ones that if they okay. catch a, a HPV infection now, in another five, ten years, they can come down with cancer because okay, they are weak. Thank weakened. you. Uh, Monday Secretary, ma. I see, see your mouth, they do muy, muy, muy. <laughs> I, I know you finish with me, I won't talk, then you go finish. You don't waste time, now make. Or you talk and finish. Now since you won't talk and... Yeah. 26 to 45 years, optional, the woman can skip screen and take the vaccine. Thank you, sir. After 45 years, it's not needed because the duration it will take for the um, cancer to develop must have 
pass, he will stay long. The poor man will be old then, so it's not necessary. Thank you. At that age. Thank you, sir. Uh, no, you still hold the microphone with you. We will come back to you. Um, uh, a B worry. He said, please. No, somebody talks. Say, uh, hey, Ijama Evergreen. He said, please, sir. Can, please, ma. Can a pregnant woman take the vaccine? Uh, uh, va um, okay. Over to you, sir. It's contraindicated for now. Yes, sir? At, that, it, at pregnancy, we don't take it at pregnancy. Okay. You don't even hear the answer now. My brothers, my sisters, make we hear from that our uncle. Just pass him over. Okay. Hembe oh, Lembe. Distinguished, oh, oh. distinguished ladies and gentlemen, good morning. I just want to add a voice to what uh, my supervisor and colleagues have said. Your name, sir? My name is Dr. Yakub Muhammad. From? Director, uh, Acting Executive Secretary, FST Primary Healthcare Board. Okay. Uh, we had once we have, in <laughs> welcome. Mm. Okay. We had once in charge of all the primary healthcare facilities across the six area councils of FCT. Uh, just to add to what my colleagues have said, um, human papilloma virus. What if you? I, we want you. I want you to picture it. Where does it act, and what does it affect? If you look at the service, it's like when you look at a pier. Uh, the end of the pier, that is the neck of the cervix, uh, that is the neck of the womb, that is the cervix. This virus goes in there. He's already, we've all already explained to, to us that it is transmitted through uh, intercourse, you understand? And then the virus has liking for the neck of the cervix, or rather the lip of the cervix. It stays there, it destroys the lip of the cervix, and over time, over time, over time, it can change the shape, uh, the integrity of the neck, uh, lip of the cervix, and over time, Take the it causes close to your mouth, so yes, mm. it causes changes, starting from something like a swelling or ulcer, and over time, it can transform into something cancer. Are okay. we together? Mm. I just want you to picture it. Where you know people come up with something at their lips, they say, Wutan, Zapin, Zabi, you understand? Some call it Danzaria, help us. Are we together? I'm be that thing. No, no, no. I'm just wanting to picture it that way. Because it's also caused by I don't do it many times. You know, and we know that just the way it affects the lip, it can also affect hair picks in the this genital women. And which if care is not taken, you know, it can also it. Now that is exactly what this virus goes to goes to do at the mouth of the, the neck of the uh, womb which we call service are we together which unlike the, the herpes and others is more deadly it can cause these changes which over years over years like dr basi has said you know can turn that also into what uh, if the woman is not uh, okay. lately is not can turn into a service so we want to encourage you and assure you that and of course uh, human papilloma virus just like you know he has said it Hepatitis B virus, we know it is tra uh, it's transmitted through intercourse. But where does it go? It goes to attack the liver. Are we together? Eh? Are we together? Yes. Look at the route of transmission, how it enters, how the virus enters the body. But see where it attacks. It attacks the liver, destroys the liver, and over time, that liver cells that are destroyed can turn into liver cancer. Similarly, I'm just trying to so that you people understand it. So in essence, or in summary, what we want to encourage you is, now we have an additional age group into our routine immunization. We already have the infants that go for all this uh, routine immunization. We have the pregnant women who receive tetanus, toxic. Now we're having another category of group. Thank young you. adolescent girls, 9 to 14 years, whom we want to encourage you and appeal to you, parents, you know, to take this your uh, young adolescent girls to the nearest healthcare facility, either our primary healthcare facilities or the secondary healthcare facilities, you know, to assess this free, safe, and effective vaccine. Okay, thank you very much. Thank sir. you very much. <laughs> uh, Kelechi, a bill I say this man they vex. Give him the microphone until he tell me say you don't talk finish. I when uh, on that man they talk, I uh, see an with anger, uh, the, uh, whispered something to the mandate secretary. The microphone is yours. Finish your talk. Even if not three o'clock, we go finish. Over to you, sir. No, we go come to you, ma. Make it, oh, make, 
You don't make you me are not talking now and say I know vex. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know me, I, I know vex. Yeah. I'm no. very observant. Very, very. I, no, we were just discussing. You I know, discern. waiting. She, uh, we put it in two different ways. No, <coughs> no. She will say, after 26 years, mm. the rate of um, reception and protection is not as good as at earlier age. I said that is why we also put it in another it's way true. that is for nine years to 26. It's true. That is more effective when the person is younger. Mm, at that true. 26 to 45 is optional. Uh, now you, you I don't put my bag on. May you flog me. May you flog me thank before you. I sit down. Okay, thank you, sir. <laughs> um, but doctor... Okay. No, you have your... your uh, okay, thank you, Honorary President. What I wanted to add, sir, is this. As we, their community, they talk to people about this HPV vaccine, many of the women are actually interested in it but is for adolescent girls, right? Like Dr. Bassi said, we want to give the vaccine to girls before they are exposed to HPV because you're preventing the infection. But the women are now asking, what is there for us? So I want to say that there is also screening, right? Women are supposed to go screen for cervical cancer at least once before age 35 and another time by the time they're age 45. When they go to screening, they look at their cervix, they take what we call pap smear, and then they check to see if there are changes in the cervix that could later lead to cancer. And if the changes are there, one thing about cervical cancer is a cancer that can be treated once you catch it on time. So that screening is also important. In fact, WHO has said to eliminate cervical cancer, from the world in the next, by the next generation, we need to do three things. Number one, 90% of girls should get the vaccine by the age of 15. Number two, 70, 90% of women should screen with a high quality screening uh, service like pap smear, like I talked about, once before 35, once before 45. Number three, at least 70% of women who have the cancer already should be treated. If we do that as a world, we will eliminate cervical cancer by the next generation. Thank you. Make we appreciate her. Uh, Monday, Secretary. I'd, I'd like to join that this screening is nothing ridiculous. Mm -hmm. You don't have to go to national hospital or come to our secondary health care centers. Even nurses have been taught a very local, simple way. It's as simple as putting an IUCD in. At times, we just use touch lights, um, a scope, look at the cervix, look for changes, and the treatment is very easy, straightforward, and affordable. Too. Thank you. Now, uh, Musa Kabiru, you say good morning, sir. Please, I want to ask... Uh, I want to ask on... Primary health care. Primary health care. The Guagua primary health care is something else. Mm -hmm. They resume 9 o'clock. They close before 4 p.m. Uh, director Hospital, Madam, Guagua, they say Guagua primary health care. They say they open 9 o'clock and they, pl they close before 4. Are you aware? Ma? If you are uh, not aware, this is a complaint. Take it with you. Okay. Mm. I'm aware that generally our primary health care facilities, some of them doesn't run 24 hours. We all know about shortage of manpower we have. But is it okay to open 9 o'clock and close three uh, before 4? No, it's not okay. It's supposed yeah, so to be 24 hours. But because of shortage of manpower, they cannot run ships. So with the and shortage one person of will not remain 24 hours there. What's normal opening time? And closing time. Eight o'clock. So, eight o'clock is the normal opening time. So when? Eight to four. Eight, eight to, to four. four. That's what is. What yes, is. eight to four. And I want to I want to use this forum to say that for the cancer screening in Apu PSC, we have a gynecular machine that women can go there and screen themselves apart from the conventional uh, pap smear in other facilities, particularly in secondary facilities. 
and is free of charge. A poor primary health care facility. A poor primary, primary health care facility. facility. That's good. Yes, it's a gynecological machine there and is free of charge for women to screen themselves for cervical cancer. Thank you very much. The number to call if you did for Inside Nigeria and a 090 The number to call if you did for Inside Nigeria and a 90 Zero zero. Mm -hmm. Monday secretary just they hear this one for the first time. <laughs> and if you day for abroad, even if na Niger or Kotonu or even our own Bakasi, we will pass on your dash Cameroon because of the oil we did there. Now plus two three four mm -hmm. eight one mm -hmm. eight eight mm -hmm. eight nine. One zero mm -hmm. one one. Mm -hmm. Once again, if you day abroad diaspora plus two three four mm -hmm. eight one mm -hmm. eight eight mm -hmm. eight nine mm -hmm. one zero mm -hmm. one one. Mm -hmm. Make we see the first lucky caller. Yeah. Nigeria abroad, Nigeria abroad, abroad. Hello, good morning. Hello, good morning, Master President. Now, who me are the Vano? Where you the Vano from? Waiting be your country protected. Uh, my name is Sonny. I the Vano from Sweden. Sonny from Sweden. Yes, Master President. Waiting be your country protected. Yes, yeah, thank you. Um, I want, I want to thank the guest to the studio. They have done so much work so far. Uh, but I'm going to go to the chief of uh, the, 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 the big madam in the studio. Uh, she mentioned that when she was uh, having her presentation, she mentioned uh, that the vaccine is not under duress. Like, it's not a force that you, you, it is a willingly. But I think, to my own opinion, we are not talking about the willingness of the, uh, if you, the willingness of the vaccine, or if you want to take or not. I think what we should be looking towards is how healthy the vaccine is, how 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 effective, what are the reactions, what how how good quality the vaccine is, so that when when the consumer takes it, it will be more, it will go down very very well. And my second question again is. Uh, what happened in Kano the last time? What was the uh, action they have taken towards the uh, Pfizer company? Uh, I did not, uh, you know, ignore, ignore the, uh, the incident that caused so many people's lives. That was my question. Thank you so much. Thank you, sir. Thank you. You hear him, Abi, you know, hear him. Okay. May somebody help Monday Secretary to take me. Hello, good morning. Good morning, my ordinary president. Now, who me and I'm the for radio and TV telephone? Uh, the man is Jamil Mohammed from Italy. Jamil Mohammed from Italy. What him be your contributor? Yes, my, my contribution is that ordinary president, there are many questions for you as you people. But uh, I want the, the answer because you say, you, you man say, now uh, one American woman. She's uh, a team head of the department. No, of the Nigerian, US, Nigerian, Nigerian uh, woman, no Nigerian the woman. That people, the Dati people kill their, their own people. So I want them to give us because here they come up. Like, all these things, I think their names are well listed. Are doing a contract with Nigerians because what they say to do because you see this vaccination. It's early to see they do. They have started doing it in Nigeria, but the, another thing come again. In Kano, this Pfizer, the same campaign where they campaign says, and another thing, come, you know, that's why you see there is some people when we love in our society, you know, that we love a very big thing. 
like his daughter, we are so rest in peace. Amen. If she sits in the weak system, different things must happen. Because they have to check the vaccine between America, the one they are using in America, the one that they are using in, in Africa. This is very, very big thing that you're supposed to understand. Not but I don't it. talk and say labs, Dave, for Nigeria, we get the capacity to, to verify, to cross-check. They yes. don't talk. Um. Yes, mm. because this is vaccine with your life. Because we know all, when we take vaccine here, yeah. when we take this COVID vaccine, yeah, yeah, we know the reaction in you. We know the reaction in you, particularly. You. So, my own, they say, please, anything that you have to do, you have to be very, very careful. Okay. Thank, thank you very much. Thank you. Hello, good morning. Hello, good morning. Hello, good morning. 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 From Istanbul, Turkey. Okay, from Istanbul, Turkey. Tolo, tolo. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Honorary President. Honorary, uh, Hamba Lambe. Oh, no, no, no. I beg, I uh, one, before I start, uh, I get one of the, uh, the cameraman. So, because this matter, and even yesterday, only very sensitive. So, I the cameraman for that sign language, make it a quarter. Shots, the first time, either by the side or up. You understand? So that or uh, they divide okay. between into two. Make a so cameraman that focus people, on yes. the okay on the sign language lady. Okay. Um, yes, on okay. the sign language. Uh, so that um, uh, this person I just and showing the other person a position to sit so that uh, a camera can capture her uh, permanently. Mm. They go. They go. Yes, yeah, permanent. They go share yes. the screen. Thank you. Yes. And uh, about this uh, vaccination, old man, uh, thank you very much. The thing you do. And when that woman, uh, the first lady, just finished, there's something that you say, you say you must verify, you must say this. And Jamie woke up from it now, so almost about what to say. And one of the uh, panel. Most of them have uh, asked the questions. So please, don't marry. Uh, we know so we will not take the and we trust and we trust on you to help us to verify this thing because most of our kids are back home and we have brothers or sisters. And what you said about this uh, uh, big gate during Corona, what happened? You understand? Even the uh, president of Tanzania have to give up on, 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 on this road. So please. Let's verify this because mostly now you can see robots now are working and they don't want this is a business. There's no more work. Everything is going online on internet. Robot they sell food, robot they deliver food. And most of us their works, we are the class, we are we they call their side now for people to work where they need to. Okay. So now they want to change, they want to reduce the population. So please, how many help us to... We are not well, sure we are and, uh, trying to reduce Thank the you very much. Thank you very much. Um, Ute, Ute, Ojo, Ute Ojo Hassan, he said, my, my daughters took the vaccine in the UK here, and they are all all right. In fact, they are both in their mid-20s now. And then, um, Kilanko Adiola, he said, my ordinary president, uh, I am disputing what Madam Mandate said. I took hepatitis B complete dose, but till now I'm feeling heavy pains at the hand I took and took, and it's up to five months now. I'm afraid of taking any vaccine. No. Now we, you don't hear now. Why don't you go back to where you took the vaccine and complain to them? Maybe... You know, you say, no be everybody. No be here with the way one uh, school for Nasarawa State, International Professional College of Waiting, 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 Science and Technology. They churn out lab te technicians and midwives. The school does not have a lab. If you go to the school now, they, uh, they will ask you, do, do you want to start from 100 level or 200 levels? Is in Nasarawa, is in existence. I brought the director of the school, director of the school to this place. 
and he said he is he is, he is registered with company uh, company and ali matters company company and allied matters the, a professor the owner of the school said he's registered with company and ali matters the school is still in existence we engaged the federal ministry of education nothing happened they made noise and nothing happened the school is still in existence churning out lab technicians midwife midwife uh, and uh, i think nurses the school is still in existence no be nigeria person will not be doctor rise to the rose to the rank of a director in the at the federal ministry of health you know be you know be doctor you know read anything will concern this thing he rose to the rank of a director a director in the federal ministry of health in nigeria so we we have the right to question a lot of things we have been deceived for too long a time and we don't the wise now so we are asking questions simple hello good morning <laughs> Good morning. Yeah, hello. Yeah, hello. Good morning, sir. Morning. Mr. President, good morning, sir. No, I don't be Mr. President, I ordinary. I've been our, our president, Natino Busa. I'm so sorry, sir. I'm so sorry, sir. Sir, I'll be trying this number soon, sir. Waiting be your name. Uh, my, my name is Mike. I'm calling you Libya, sir. Libya. Yes, sir. Waiting carry you go, Libya. <laughs> sir. Mm -hmm. I know if you are lying, me, yeah. I don't date for sort of my family for years. You won't follow Libya, go Europe, now nah, you date trapped, I'll be how? <laughs> yes, sir, I won't follow, I won't follow Libya, go Italy, because they don't track you up for what I want to wear. So you can't do it for, for Libya now? <laughs> yes, sir. I hope life they favor you, dear sir. No be by force to stay abroad, come back home. We still need you. We no reject yes, you. Now you want Jackpa now, Jackpada. <laughs> Uh, sir, that's why, sir. That's why, sir. We need your assistance, please, sir. Assistance to come back. Yes, sir. Send me your details. I will arrange, me them bring you back to Nigeria, sir. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. Yes, sir. Hello. Good morning. Morning, my ordinary president. Yes. Yes. My yeah. ordinary president, I haven't called you several times and you said that you could get back to me and you yeah, know you are... Waiting be your name, where about, you live are not from, waiting be uh, your complaint. Uh, about my family matter that I haven't reported to you last time. What is your name? My name is Radu Sandata. You are calling from where? I'm calling from Habuda, yeah. And you, you, you don't have respect for yourself not to call this number. End this call. Okay. I make a no okay. call, you, call you back. Respect yourself before I end this call for your head. We want Nigeria to be better, and yet we are not ready to do the needful, the right thing. Hello, good morning. Good morning, Jim. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Now, who is the man for radio and TV telephone? Um, I am Ambassador Simon Peter, and I am the man from Japan. Oh, our Brekata family ambassador in Japan. Your Excellency Simon Peters. Good morning. How is Japan this morning? Good morning. Good evening, my ordinary. Yoshi, why Yoshi? Ha. That one is China. Okay. My what is your contributor, sir? Ah, uh, may God bless you, my ordinary president. Amen, and you too, sir. Uh, I really appreciate you sir, for bringing uh, our minister one by one to the studio. When they come, juice their mouth, they chop onion, mm. or whether or garlic they like to the chop. Mm. Uh, yesterday, for the minister of uh, interior, you know, I really appreciate everything he said. And even though 
uh, the you have already fought the battle of a passport issue mm. uh, in Japan that we have already won it has been oh, settled oh. since you last year. For Japan. Japan has not been. Make we appreciate ourselves. Yes, and, uh, then be the complete yes, about sir. passport issue for Japan. We carry them up here because within uh, the issue yeah. of uh, sending it by post. You don't have to go and collect after you do your catchery. Mm. It has been working already in Japan since mm. last year already, mm. even before this minister came in. Mm. Uh, and the one thing that we still want the minister to do, as I've already he talked about it, just like he used Canada to give uh, such an example. And you see the same thing here in Japan. Uh, you know, there are four major states here in Japan that we appreciate the minister to you know for name, them to be coming name them name the uh, uh, nagoya city mm -hmm. uh, osaka city mm -hmm. and uh, nagasaki <laughs> city mm. so the, the three, three you mentioned you may remain one you remain one nagoya nagasaki then uh, nagoya uh, uh, osaka and then nagasaki are they here massacre for a <laughs> <laughs> so uh these three places like even me we live in nagoya city from where we are by express highway by driving no traffic lights for that place it will take you five hours no traffic lights just express it will take you five hours which is still very a little bit closer i'm sure like people living in Arasaki, it will take that 24 hours to get to where the embassy are to go and do casually Okay. So, which is very far. Um, so, we will appreciate the minister Let's to work on it. And uh, I, I promise you between now and February, they will resolve yes, that on an issue based on waiting to material come present here for studio. Yes, sir. Thank you very much, sir. Then, as for... Yes, I saw one more thing. As for the vaccine uh, issue, uh, my ordinary president, you know, during Corona vaccine, you know, when I took the vaccine, he almost caused madness in me. I didn't know when I put my underwear, I used it to clean my bum and I put it inside the toilet. <laughs> I was sweating. Na, you know, where are you so, the vaccine for Nigeria, I'll be for Japan, I'll be Pajan. No, no, in, in Japan. Okay. So, the, what, what I'm saying is that uh, everything we have tested in the lab, even the lab, is not 100% guarantee. After the investigation, there, is, there was still some error in the vaccine that even the lab could not even detect it. Mm. But uh, some of the wrong vaccine, then some of them were administer to people which i was even one of the people they administer some to okay. you know and again before you took any vaccine my ordinary president mm. there is a, a, a fund they are supposed to send to every individual when they are talking about everybody to come and take vaccine that you have to fill out your health history so as you get to the hospital when you submit that form when they look at it that is what they will determine whether you will take the vaccine or not. Okay, thank so you. So is our this minister one, there going this, to go through that process? Sorry, this one where we they talk about now something when they don't, yes, sir. they don't do study over the years and they discover say women in their thousands are dying in Nigeria. Yes, sir. And uh, they can't uh, can discover this vaccine when we say now prevention is it will be to, okay. to young people according to a presentation yes, they sir. make for studio thank you very yes, much sir. thank you yes sir thank you um shagun samuel he said the monday secretary is brilliant and highly diplomatic president bola ahmed Tinubu made the right choice by appointing her no unnecessary story she gives valid points and keep quiet not true <laughs> People are, uh, are uh, some chef, don't they ask me whether you don't marry? <laughs> toasting, toasting does that. Hello, good morning. Amber, Amber. Oh, no, no, no. 
Sir, it, 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 it's Mike, sir. I want to ask, where can I send the Sam, video, where? sir? Where can be your name? Where you they know from? I'm going to call you for Mr. Iridia, sir. Uh-huh. Yes, sir. Send sir. me your details now. I'll go send them to uh, the Breakout family WhatsApp. I go. Oh, sir, I don't have the WhatsApp, sir. Okay, 090. Mm -hmm. Okay, sir. Let me write it, sir. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. 090. Uh -huh. 090. Uh -huh. 090. Uh -huh. 090. <laughs> Calm okay, down, calm down, calm down. Okay, sir. 090. 090. You don't write them. Yes, I know that, sir. Then you go write three. Three. Uh, you don't write three. I, I don't write three, sir. Then three. you go write zero, zero into four places. Zero, 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 zero. Okay, sir. Zero into four places, sir. You don't write them? Yes, sir. Then you go write 441. Okay, sir. 441. Oh, you download our application. We'll be bracketed connect. Okay, sir. When you enter bracketed okay, connect, there is appointment with the ordinary president. Just click there. Give me the information. I go get them now. Okay. Then can I even open the application make we see okay sir now god bless this you, is sir. the application god bless you, sir yes sir thank you. With you sir yes sir thank god you god bless sir now make we check complex this these are the complaints we have received so far this is today's complaints from all over the world These are complaints from all over the world. So, Breketa Connect. Either you go to the App Store or you go to the Play Store. Abi? Play Store iOS and then yeah, Play Store and App Store. Uh, one of the complaints here is the heading is Father that has so much offended his parents and refused to apologize. My father has issues with his parents. He insulted his mother to her face and slept with his father's wife. He so much believed in Juju, they told him that if he apologized to the mom, he will die. His father died in pains and agony without seeing his son, who is my father. Please, sir, I pray, I pray God will use you to settle my family. Mm -hmm. Now they can't complain. Where will they receive be that? And um, God is going to use us to settle the family. Good idea, yes? Yes, sir. Uh, but some of them, where they repeat on our complaint two, three times. If you do it more than two times, I will ignore your case and I will not do the case. Make we take this call. Hello, good morning. Hello. Hello, good morning. Yes, now, whom and I'm the Vano, where you the Vano from? Good morning, my president. This is Mohammed Konate. I'm calling you from England. From? From England. Mohammed okay, Mohammed Konate from England. <laughs> yes, how is the, I call, how um, is the king? The next time, next day. How is the king? Huh? How is the king of England? He's been very fine. That's mm -hmm. my president. Okay. Oh, yeah, talk. What I called talking? you the last, uh, the beginning of this month. They told me to call you next day, but uh, Mama, the talk line to has me been confidently good like a man talking to a fellow man, sir. You are fluctuating. Yes, sir. Uh, I said I called the next, I called the last time. You told me to call back, but the line has been busy. I could not reach you. Immediately after the program today, call back, sir. Uh, this number? Yes, sir. Okay, sir. Thank oh. you, sir. Hello, good morning. <laughs> To call that, but yeah, hello, what is your name? Where are you from? Uh, good morning, you're my president, yes, sir. Yes, ma. What is your name? My name is uh, Falake. Falake, where are you from? I'm from London. London. I'm sorry. Uh, which part of London? It's nice to talk to you, sir. 
Ah. You think this vaccine will try to depopulate some people, though? Eh? Sir, this vaccine where they won't give us, mm. they are trying to, to make people, to African people to go down. That's what they're doing. Madam, where are you talking to say you day? Eh? Where are you talking to say you day? I don't for London. Come back to Nigeria and stay with us before you you, you talk this kind of thing. Over there, if the thing happen London. to you, hospital, better hospital, they will they go take care of you. You better make, make we prevent yeah, to struggle for to struggle for cure. Hello, good morning. Oh, lo, lo, lo. What team be your name? Where you they come from? My name is Steve Obedi, calling from Manchester. Uh, uh, Steve Obedi. Uh, yes, yeah. mommy called you three days ago. I'm uh, making help my community from Manchester. Where, where team be the name of your community, sir? Uh, uh, you, you, say, you say make I send the complaint to uh, the connect. I don't send the complaint. And I know what repeat on two times because you said you said they can't make not they repeat complaint for more than one. Wait him be the name so, of your community. A wohini. A wohini. A wohini. Which state? Yes, in a dead state. Which local government? Uh, 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 it's a southeast local government. Wait him be the thing we will now need for that community. We, 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 network will not get network. Which network net, not get there? Which network will now want MTN so, Glow Nine Mobile? Choose one. What, but, but MTN they them but work. We not they get network. Then they carry. Then they carry my mother go junction before he can receive my phone call. And now I lost my mother too recently. So we are still suffering the same pain. No network there. Just hold the line. I beg. No end this call now, yes, please. Just hold the line, sir. Okay, sir. Hello, sir. Hello, okay, Biggie. Yes, Abdullah Hussein, good morning, sir. Good, good morning, sir. We did live on air now on Break at a Family, Human Rights Radio and Television, sir. All right, sir. You get one person we call, we call from Manchester. It a request for network, make it day for their village for Edo State. And the name of the village na Iwohimi. Iwohimi. Yes. Iwohimi. Ewo Ewo. Iwohimi. 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 E W O. Eh. E W O. H I. H I. M I. Okay. Iwohimi. Yes. Uh, Biggie, Ab yes, hold on, uh, Abdul. Yes, sir. Can you give them network in two months' time? Yes or no? Yeah, uh, if you have present, yeah, we can do that. So what I just need is the content of the place. Today, today, I will give you feedback. Our people will check it and know that. You must give me feedback people. today. If nine mobile no feed do am, I go call MTN. If MTN uh, no feed do am, I go let's call Glo. Once you give us the coordinate, I will confirm to you. Now we we'll teach up you of time if you can deliver there or not. Okay, thank you. Make we appreciate uh, Abdullah Hussein <laughs> of nine mobile. Thank you very much. Ingo, get back to me, uh, my brother. I don't yeah. start your work already. By the God, continue to bless you, ordinary president. God, continue to bless you Amen, and sir. every member of the uh, of the family. Amen. We trust you, our hero, Thank any you, day, any time. Thank you, We are sir. proud of you. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. Yes, sir. Hello, good morning. Good morning. Yeah, my good morning. Good morning, sir. Yeah, good morning. Good morning. Whether I open your mouth, talk to me, or, or I end the call now and pick another one. Let me end them. No time to waste. You talk the way you talk to me. Hello? Hello? Hello, good morning. 
Good morning, sir. Waiting be on them where you devan from the Yes, sir. I'm the I'm the calling from I'm the calling from Abuja. Waiting be on waiting be on name, sir. Calm down. My name, my name is Fakiru. And I'm right here in Lagos. From where? Thank you for working for 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 us. Please, I don't I don't have message since almost three months now. I didn't get back. And they told me, that's a long battle. So, my father, I came to Abuja. Your office. That's a banner side. So, when I read there, I meet one lady. One lady, that time, the lady is very pregnant. He gave me the address. And he gave me the address. So, I write the letter now. She's becoming the mother, go to offer. I said, go to offer now. After a week, my dad called me to make a call. Because one of my sisters will follow me, you get her problem. So I say, do, 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 do. They don't cast off money. If you know, I think that because the old one, nobody say, in the trial, you know, what I'm doing is for you. Oh, that was your complaint, sir. I need help for my sister. We have to go. I'm going to boy and help one of the people. What kind of help? Uh, yes, sir. Uh, you have that maybe you can bring a cousin, so maybe she can go out with you. Because one of my sister, you come and say, Mika, if you can't go to Kano, you say, you go, you go. Hello, good morning. If you don't make sense, I go through with you. Hello, good morning. Hello. Yes, wait a minute. I'm going to tell you, I call her, I'm going to tell you. Eh? Sonny from Sweden, what can be your contributor, sir? Yes, uh, this one has nothing to do with our here in the studio. I want to know a complaint concerning one of the uh, family member. His name is Bright in Austria. His name is um, what? Um, his, name is, his name is Bright from Austria. Bright from Austria. Yes. Um, that was the case. Uh, 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 I don't, I don't have a problem with him. It's just because of the case that mentioned what was in time concerning a uh, young man that died in Austria. And his name was mentioned. And as a, as a, as a family member, we are able to represent our image and also as a, as a family image as well. So he needs to come and clarify himself concerning the, the, the death of that young man called Chester. Are Austria. you accusing because him of killing the young man? Who, who mentioned his name? The, the of the mentioned his name. When did they mention his name and where did they mention his name? The day they had they had the the case in the in the studio and uh, and uh, the then I have not had anything concerning the case and the the man the. the the brother of the disease is no, is no longer coming in the studio. So I, I, I don't, I don't yes, even sir. know how to do Do you have anything against this person? I don't have anything against so, him. Please. I'm, I'm concerned of the interest of the, interest, uh. Uh, the dignity and the interest they have possessed. Here. Dignity because and interest. The complainant did not come back to complain. What is your own? Are you going to force a complainant to complain? Unless you have yeah, something it, against this person and you are trying to use this problem to attack the person. So any place. I don't know him from anywhere. I don't because I saw him long time. Oh, to tell, to the tell the family to come back. Tell the family to come back. We know the shave person ampit where the person I don't even know the family just because I had the I had the kids and I was too tough. Okay, thank you very much for your concern. Alright, thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Hello, good morning. We go take three more calls, come back to the studio, then relieve them to go. Hello, good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Governor President. Waiting be your name, where you did Vano from? 
My name is Kingsley. I live from Maltese Island, Malta. Maltese Island, Malta. Yes. Now, there then they do Malta Guinness. <laughs> no, sir. Okay. Now, country on its own. Now, the name is Malta. Okay, which team be your contributor, sir? See, from everything why they, why they hear from the station now, at least, are they convinced that this one now are true? Say they don't care. Are they good for us? But my question now is, they say, where uh, they the way those people come Kano, come to that show they do for Kano. Thank you. And that one and one. That, time. that one and one. Number two. After the if you take one away come to one, when the thing come out, what did they do? Hmm. And is it in me say God may not be aware somebody from outside, enter inside Nigeria, come destroy Nigerian children. Then how the woman where would they get confident on government? If this kind of thing is anything against them, that's so easy. How would they get confident? So make it uh, tell us what did they do after that thing happened and where they did before it happened. Thank you very much. Mention, mention. Thank you. Hello, good morning. Hello, good morning. Good morning, ma. Waiting be your name. Where you did off from? Good morning, Honorable President. Good morning. My name is Chimwanya. I'm calling from London. Chimwanya, Chimwanya. <laughs> <laughs> Ordinary, mm -hmm. may God continue to bless you. Amen. You know, Amen. when you are reading something from the um, break, the connect, mm -hmm. I said, No time of complaint when a little bring for break the family, mm -hmm. and you're a shock absorber, you know, you're a problem solver. May God continue to bless you Amen. and increase you. Amen. May God bless you. The family. Amen. May God bless Nigeria. Amen. Please condone my condolence to Barista Pamela. Yes. Sir. Thank you, ordinary president. Mm. Bye. Bye. <sighs> Good morning. Hello. Good morning. Basi, Basi, he said, please, me, about my sister, who has the same case of that woman this morning. She's suffering and talking like a mad woman. Please help me, sir. Basi is my name. Thank you. I know which case we do of madness this morning. We don't do anyone. We do anyone? No, sir. My imagination. Hello, good morning. Good morning. And good morning. Yeah, good morning. Now, who me and I'm the Vanos, sir? Hello? Hello. What is your name? Hello? My name is Jolof. They come from Saba, from Libya. Your name is Jolof? Jolof. They come from Saba, from Libya. Okay, Zainab from Libya. Yeah. Then traffic you to? No. You go Libya by yourself? I don't think she's a dog, but no, the disease will come. Now, the, the traffic you be that now. Waiting, be them, be, be, tell, tell you before you, you follow them, leave Nigeria. They meet my mom and my stepfather say, nah, hey, now I'll sleep. So, oh, of the gang. But you, as you wish, my you, father, you come to, 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 to plate her. Mm, oh, my mother. Only for them to convert you to uh, sell body, Abby? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you don't make enough money to come back? No. You don't. You, 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 that small boy touch me. The the guy will see the require small boy for this place, which is a uh, this kidnapper. They don't kidnap you. How much did they ask for, Zainab? Hello, Zainab. Phoebe said the master don't see him. Collect the phone for her. <laughs> now beating now. She go collect. Hello. <laughs> Good morning. The family. Ma, what's your name? Where you did you from? 
I own to Berekete family. Yeah, you did own to Berekete family. Okay, I just want to make some contribution. What be your name? Where you did know from? My name is Josephine. I'm calling from England, United Kingdom. Josephine from okay, England. Captain? Make you off that TV where you take the monitor the program so that the communication will be oh, okay. Give me a minute. I nah, don't give you a minute. In it. Okay, we they hear you quickly. Time don't go. Monday secretary don't retire. Okay, um, I'm calling to make uh, a little contribution towards um, the issue of um, uh, the HPV uh, vaccination. Mm. Okay, contribute. Are you now. there? Then they hear you. Okay, so what I'm, I'm saying is, um, the summer called and said they called from UK earlier and was saying um, they're trying to reduce the population of Nigeria by introducing the vaccine. I don't subscribe to that. Mm -hmm. um, here in the UK, my children have had the vaccine when it started, and they're both okay since when they had it. Um, so they're not reducing any um, population. I think it's a good thing mm. from health um, perspective uh, because it's better, like the secretary had said earlier, it's better to prevent than to try to provide a cure um, from the disease control um, aspect of things. Okay. And so if we have a vaccine that some country have had for America had it introduced in 2006, UK here, they had it introduced in 2012. My first daughter was one of the first people to benefit from it in 2012. Uh, and she's going strong. Josephine. Pardon? I, Josephine. Yes? I will play one video where all of us go watch. Okay. We make, okay. we begin suspect the vaccine. The person we sponsor, we oh. donate this vaccine. Nine be the issue number one. We trigger our, you know, say, when you see um, foul dead body, for front of dog cage. Your, your yes. first conclusion na, na the dog killer. But when you see dog true, true, for true, front true, of the uh, foul cage, you go the one that waiting killer. Now, if yes. you are ready with the video, end this call now. D let them play a video for you to listen to uh, uh, Bill Gates somewhere. Thank you. If the people the are ready, of give Africa us is set to almost double by 2050, raising fears that progress in fighting poverty and disease will be reversed. So what can be done to ensure that poverty doesn't increase? And how can a disproportionately large youth population help drive progress? With me to discuss all of this and more is Bill Gates. Bill, are we at a turning point where regression is a real risk? Well, first, uh, the progress over the last several decades has been pretty amazing, both reducing child to death, uh, getting kids in school, getting agricultural productivity up, and reducing extreme poverty. But it's really Africa that still has a doubling in population to 2050 and probably uh, another doubling to 2100 where you really have to do a good job if you're trying to get these extreme poverty rates down. So if we don't do better in investing in human capital in Africa, yes, the uh, number of people in extreme poverty is actually going to go up. Should the solution or should more solutions be focused on slowing that growth? So, for example, increasing reproductive rights for women or spreading the access to contraceptives? Because it seems that, is it correct that no amount of investment can really keep pace with that population growth? What we do between now and 2050 with education, with uh, economic growth, uh, with health and nutrition, that'll really set the course uh, for moderating the population growth between 2050 and 2100. But it's really a virtuous cycle, letting women have uh, uh, reproductive health tools that they want, you know, educating girls, raising agricultural productivity, uh, getting these malnutrition interventions, 
on a much uh, greater scale than we have today. Those are the things you would want to do anyway. It turns out that uh, by doing those well, you also uh, set the, the population growth rate coming down quite a bit. And so uh, it just makes it that much more imperative that we invest in the human capital now and so that the challenge of what under any scenario will be fairly high population growth uh, that you're able to benefit from all those young people uh, making a, a big contribution to their country. So is the fact that Africa has such a, a high proportion of youth population and, and within the context of this predicted growth, is that something that you think is a sort of optimistic statistic? I mean, is it a good thing that there's, uh, there's an opportunity here to sort of harness the power of those young people? It's both a, an opportunity and a challenge because the capacity to run the health systems well, to uh, get uh, the education system to have not only high attendance, but uh, good learning outcomes as well. That's not going to be easy. If we don't make these investments, that youth bulge uh, you know, will be a, a huge challenge because they won't have uh, the, the development, they won't have the economic opportunity uh, that they deserve. So it's potentially an asset. But if we don't invest right, it, it could even be a liability. Let's talk about digital technology for a minute. We know that more people than ever before are connected, more people than ever before have bank accounts. Those are both positives. But what would you say are the biggest opportunities in digital technology in terms of fighting poverty and disease? Yeah, digital innovation is really pervasive. And so whether it's uh, tracking, do you have the vaccines out uh, where they should be, uh, getting feedback from citizens, you know, is the teacher showing up uh, and, and doing a good job. Digital systems let you achieve a uh, you know, higher quality and really assure, whether it's the domestic taxpayers or the donors, uh, that their money's going uh, to the right things in a way that without digital we couldn't do. I just want to turn back to the U.S. for a minute. Under the current U.S. administration, under President Donald Trump, there's been a lot of threats to cutting the foreign aid budget and even withholding uh, funding from U.N. agencies. Is it damaging that kind of rhetoric that exists right now? Well, certainly, <clears throat> if countries turn inwards and they're not thinking about uh, the long term and you know this uh, challenge of helping Africa. Uh, develop in a, a very stable, uh, self-sufficient way. If you think uh, that helping other countries over time is not beneficial, uh, then that, that's going to you know, be turning back on this, this model of helping out uh, the poorest. And so when those recommendations in the U.S. to cut the foreign aid budget that came out of, out of the executive branch uh, were put forward, uh, you know, we certainly, our, our foundation uh, was talking with Congress about what we've seen, that foreign aid is working super well, whether it's malaria, HIV, and so many different areas. And it was very pleasing that the Congress, on a very bipartisan basis, chose to maintain these commitments uh, that are so critical. So foreign aid uh, has stayed flat. Um, you know, ideally, it would be going up. But in the face of uh, some of this turning inwards, the fact that uh, the European countries have remained generous and the U.S. levels uh, are, are steady, uh, that, that is a good thing. We just you know, have to continue to make sure it's, it's uh, spent as, as best we can. Okay, and one final question for you. Uh, there's a question in the report that really stood out to me, which is, it asks, is extreme poverty inevitable? Could you summarize what it will take to ensure that poverty is not inevitable? We know what works. Uh, you know, human capital, uh, agricultural sector, taking advantage of innovation, whether that's new seeds, new vaccines, or the digital platform. You know, it's clear if we, if we make the right investments to help these countries, uh, they can get virtually all their system, citizens out of extreme poverty. Population growth in poor countries is the biggest problem they face. There's too many people on the planet we need to get rid of, in the words of Bill Gates, at least three billion people. 
need to die. By the end of the century, almost half the young people in the world will be in sub-Saharan Africa. 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 For the purpose of sterilization. The first vaccine uh, that was ever created specifically for Africa. Vaccine. 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 At least three billion people need to die. So we'll just start off in Africa. Una, welcome back. Una, welcome back. You see, Una, no hear him directly from Bill Gates, but Una, hear all the narratives. And these people now analyze and they analyze the activities of Bill Gates. I don't know whether I want to understand. That is enough for us to say, mm, where is it coming from? I don't know whether you understand. Pekin, where they grow, the, if the first cup where you give them something way sweet, na red, anytime where you see red cup, it go they salivate. The cup where you give them First bitter thing for a mouth, if not white, anytime where you see bit, uh, a white cup, until it tests that thing, if you force them, then you go come and discover, say, no, be every white cup, they contain bitter content. Are we together? Yes, Are we, have we had a very good engagement today? Yes, sir. Una don't they, empowered enough to decide what I want to do. Yes, sir. Thank you. But I don't know whether Monday Secretary get anything to add on top. Monday Secretary, man, if you get anything to add on top before we allow you to come out. But before then, somebody talks, say, that uh, message where I read about sister where they mad, say, nah, the same thing where this man do this woman, collect her children. Nine make her they behave like mad woman many women are depressed because of that thing yes. it's a psychological torture yes. we should not allow it we should not allow it and most men where they do this thing now men will marry woman from a poor family yes. they believe say your family no go if you do anything in fact some of them don't buy over your relations your relations are worshipping them. So nobody, in fact, they would prefer to see your corpse than to see you back home. Yes, yes. So I beg, give us the description of where this man, they, with this woman, children, we go recover the children by the grace of God, and we may go we make sure, say, the woman get justice and treatment by the grace of God. Yes, Monday Secretary, over to you. Um, thank you, everyone, again. And it is very interesting that we have a fora like this where the general public can come and air their problems. It is more interesting to announce here that this administration has zero tolerance to gender violence. Zero. A man is not allowed to touch his wife. Neither is a woman allowed to beat her husband. Mm. There are laws against it. The first lady of this nation is, is an advocate of zero tolerance to gender violence. I will send all the toll-free numbers where you can call. A doctor yesterday was sentenced to life imprisonment. For, uh, a medical for doctor for molesting a 16-year-old. In Nigeria here? Yeah. In Lagos. A doctor that I know personally. Mm. I know BGYN. So the laws are starting to work because we have a system and there's political will. Now, also, in addition to that, I did a bit of psychiatry. When we go into the psychiatric wards, especially the female side, there are two things that usually bring them there. One, either there's family history, or second, is their husband. Yes, it is love. My husband married somebody else. My husband's family is trying to, or they have used my children against me. But the good news is that there is help. 
This is called paranoid schizophrenia. People get depressed, people get anxious. And the better thing is that there's also free help in this our health insurance scheme. When we know people like this, I will leave numbers, all our primary health care centers. We have a pocket for vulnerables, people who cannot afford to pay. We register them under this scheme and they can come and access free health care. And in closing, that man, Bill Gates, said the population of the world is too much. Maybe if he removed himself, we would be less. Mm, okay. And mm. <laughs> that's the only thing that came to my mind. That's the only thing that came to my mind. However, I want to say that this vaccine, this particular one, is from Global Alliance Vaccine Initiative, Gavi, and not Bill Gates. Thank you very much, everyone. Thank you. Before she go, go, other people uh, will talk. But at the end of the day, now she go talk last. Uh, but we go hear from other people, then we go come back to her. Uh, Olad, Oladi, Oladi Pupo, Oluwa Toyin, he say, my ordinary president, please help a widow. Someone lied against her, and they threw her, they threw her in the prison. They free those who committed the offense. Uh, give us uh, uh, more information. We make we submit the prison, her prison number. That is enough for us to send our lawyers to go and rescue her by the grace of God. Thank you. <laughs> Meanwhile, uh, people for studio will not get questions. Okay, Elder, may could I give Elder a microphone? Thank you very much, my honorable president. Mm -hmm. uh, I want to start by saying that um, the, this product, the vaccine in question, is from America, right? And I also know that most of the, most of the Americans in Nigeria don't use drugs in Niger or Nigerian hospitals. They use the drugs that they brought all the way from their own country. Why is this so? And if these drugs are useful and good, as we are, uh, we are made to understand, why are they not using it? Why must they use, and Nigerians in America use the drugs made in America. They don't come to Nigeria or carry drugs in Nigeria to use in America. That is one, sir. Mm -hmm. The number two is that my other president talk about uh, uh, GMO product. He fought that for over six years. And I remember very, very well that at that particular time, that it was uh, senior staffs up to the director level Professors. that lead, yeah, prof very well, sir, that lead the team that came to our studio then. And let me not use word because we don't use word, the word lie. Told the whole world that yes, they are hundred percent sure that what they are defending is correct and is good. Today, revise is the case. And again, this GMO products in Nigeria, no tag number, no tag whatsoever. So as you enter the market, wherever they are selling it, you buy it like normal products. Unlike in US, where other part of the world, developed world, they, what, they, they, they label they, it. They, they, they label it. This is GMO product. This is organic product. So you know what you want, you go for it. But the organic Nigeria, is no. more expensive. Here in Nigeria, it's not like that. So I want us to understand something. If somebody walk up to you and said, by tomorrow, you, I may not see you again, it's two things. You will think whether it's to come and kill you or to kill himself or to disappear. Mm. Now somebody will get up overnight and say, I'm coming to save you. I doubt whether that save is truly safe. And I want to quickly add here, sir that before they started this vaccine product, yeah. what they did, what the American did was to go to these small, small African countries to convince them or confuse them to accept that the product is good. After that, they know that Nigeria is the biggest market. Mm. So when they convince other mm. countries, those small, small countries, getting Nigeria will not make be reference to that one. Exactly. This is my own opinion. Thank okay. you very much, sir. Thank you very much. Uh, hello, good morning. So, 
Olubu me want talk. Hello, good morning. Waiting be on where you did van off from. Thank you. Okay, ma'am. Bright give an offer. Hold on first. Okay. Hello, waiting be your name. Bright from Vienna, Austria. Bright from uh, Vienna, Austria. Yes, sir. Yeah. Uh, first of all, Madam President, I greet you and uh, I thank God for bringing you back to the studio. Um, I also thank God for the life of Akara Makala and the deepest condolences goes to our sister Barista Pamela for the loss of her. Madam mm. President, sir. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, it's a good thing that our minister now they come to studio to come talk and people they ask questions. The minister is going to get waiting to hide. The, yes. the other ones will get something to hide, no go come. Like the ones who will be former governors, who will no say them thief money for their state. They no say if they come here, I go disgrace them. Yes, but at least we will invite them. They will not say just come. Like they have to say that they have something to hide. Mm. But we will invite them. Mm. But what I want to add for this um, vaccine issue is this, uh, the vaccine of the people we talk now is a very sensitive and delicate matter all over the world, not also in Nigeria. But we get one call a wake call last time, we call today, earlier. He said that uh, for years, I think Simon Peter from Japan, for years, too, too, if you want better way to do a uh, vaccine for Corona, before you go take the vaccine, they will first put you for one room first. Somebody interview you, interview you, ask you that I get. Oh, no, never. I guess it's you to speak or something. The vaccine comes for something that everybody must, everybody must not take it. So I don't know whether this is um, what they do for Nigeria now, whether, whether they take it people. If not, I think it will be a good thing. That they interview people because to know who and who is supposed not to say my person is dead pregnant, you know, to take them. No, he can be pregnant, he doesn't know if they're pregnant, but still, he moves to take them. According to the experience, who the doctor, I'm not in the medical field, but the experience will get for here. He leave when your experience. Something. In our professionals, they here, leave your experience, put them for pocket. Okay, the mm. professionals say, this is what I'll be saying. Make them all over Nigeria. Lots of our lots on this particular this thing will go around the whole Nigeria. That is just my contribution. Sir. Thank you very much, sir. Right from right. Hello, good morning. Hello, good morning. What team be your name? Where are you divan off from? Today I am calling from Abuja here. You say? You know the shame. Hello, good morning. Wait him be your name. Where you devan off from? Good morning. Good morning. Hello, good morning. Some Nigerians now flash then they flash. Good morning. Hello, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, sir. What team be your name? Where are you devano from? My name is Charity. Sir. I'm calling from Kaduna. Kaduna, which part of Kaduna, ma? Bolungora, sir. Okay, what team be your contributor to Madam Chacha? I just thought to thank God for your help. Mm, thank you. Yeah. May God bless you, sir. Amen. And you too, my thank you. Long life. Amen. And you too. Yeah, well. May your husband never suffer waste pain. Amen. 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 May he never experience power failure on duty. Amen. Hello, Amen. good morning. Hello, good morning. Good morning. Hello, good morning. 
Good morning, I'm very fortunate. Now, who my name is Macro Commission Stay. Your name is Mahen Belende. Oh, no, 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 no. You say your name, I'm, I'm Caro, five years your Caro. Ah, Caro, Carola. 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 How are you doing? You just spend now, but. You just spend now, be Italy. Eh? Where are you there now? Spain or be Italy? No, not Spain. I did. Okay. Tenerife. Okay, well done, ma. Well done. Wait in your contributor yes, quickly. Sir? Mm. Sir? Mm. I did hear you. Wait in your contributor. Uh, I say, I will tell you thank you. Thank God for your quick comeback. Oh, I'm very, very happy. Thank All you. this while, you know, say, as I said, send you say, I don't go to school, I don't know what to do, I don't know what to talk. Mm. My own, we say, no God, make it help us. No, that's our country, make it better, because now there I be called. Mm. That will be my contribution. Thank so you. So, Father, make it do, make it work for us. Make it do work when you do do for us. I'm happy. Thank you, man. Thank you, sir. Mention, mention, mention. Hello, good morning. Morning, my ordinary president. Now, who me and I'm Devano for radio and TV telephone? Uh, this is Arinze. Please, I want to say something. Arinze from where? Literally. Hello? Arinze, open my talk to me like man talk to me, talk you yeah. to a fellow man. Yeah, my ordinary president, please, I want to speak on the the lady that was stolen, uh, the kidney was stolen. I did hear you. Hello? Yeah, please, is it possible I speak with her? Because she happens to be my schoolmate and my classmate. And, and your schoolmate and classmate. Her. Madam, come here. Your schoolmate, uh, come here, please, ma. No, no run, no run. Your condition no good for run now. You can say I will fit carry yourself. I will carry you. Um, Arinze. Yeah. What him be her name? How you take no say na your uh, schoolmate? Yeah, her name is uh, Edna Anyehu from Obuno, Okano, Oka South, Sanabra State. Yes, sir. You make you ask her whether she remember you. Describe yourself. You know. Her. Oh, yeah, come now. Yeah. Uh, describe yourself to her. May she remember you. She there here with me. If you look at TV now, you go see us together. No, I'm not with television. Oh, yeah. I'm just uh, outside. Oh, so describe you yourself know. to her, sir. Uh, Edna, uh, I, read, I speak my language. Yes, please, go ahead. Yeah, Edna, uh, I read, again, I go to secondary school, now I'm going to community and primary school. I'm going to go to community and primary Achetosim. 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 Describe yourself now. Now you, uh, they wear yeah. tia tia trousers at that time. <laughs> <laughs> no, my ordinary like I me, don't wear tia tia My tia tia primary tia. school mates, it's, if you talk, say, that boy will wear now only one button. They in shirt. Here, here they open. Here, they open. Trousers tia tia, na me. My primary is, is, is school pictures. You go see me. Now, me, they do like this, or you see me do like this. All our pictures. It is very easy to describe. Uh, I've been here. Uh, you, they carry last that time. I've been married to a man, and they do, uh, they do left hand together in the same school that you. I think she can remember that she's a lefty and a lefty also. Lefty, lefty. So I. Yes. In the right with lefty, lefty. You'll be right with left. Hey. Yes, ordinary president. You know I stop in SS1. So, uh, you know say she stop for it, SS1, it, ba? Who I come marry? As the uh, first her marry. So I can't. I don't feel remember. No, no worry. You go remember. Do you, uh, Arinze. Do you use left? Yes. Yes. Right. Arinze. Mister. Oh yeah, ordinary president. Okay, who be your closest friend that time for school, sir? Like, he don't take it, 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 uh, uh, we, our 
uh, one of them uh, is uh, let me mention from the place you can remember we have okay ketchum okay yes. we have it for a young again uh Nabo. yes we yes, have a lot yes. of them we are together then mm. maybe she will remember you now. don't have you short but not yeah i'm sure i'm sure you you yeah no me and you who told pass uh, uh, little, little, you are taller than I. Oh, I'm taller okay, than you. Uh, me too, now, now small, I take escape. <laughs> 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 so, I'm going to present me, I need to contact at least the little I can do. Madam, give him your number now. 081 mm -hmm. 7 Come, hold down, come, hold down. This is reunion. Now, how God they send in angels mm. to intervene for person life be this. Now waiting she passed through. Now trauma now make God. her mm. remember. Mm. Are you ready for the phone number, sir? Hello, sir. Hey, Jehovah. Oh. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hello? Please, you can call the number again. Uh, 081 uh -huh. 78-778-778-9966. Calm down. Mm -hmm. Now, your old boyfriend. <laughs> no, admire, admire. <laughs> Repeat the number again, gently. 081. Hey, Chineke, this thing don't end. No worry. We we'll go get her. Okay, sir. We we'll go get her. Thank you. Come repeat your number again. Ingo, 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 Ingo play back the this thing. Oh yeah. Zero eight one mm. seven eight mm. seven seven eight mm -hmm. nine nine six. Mm. You know too much. Repeat them again. Zero eight one mm. seven eight mm. seven seven eight mm -hmm. nine nine six. Thank you. And your name na Edna Eze. Now, many people go call you today. Minimum 1,000 people. Some go encourage you. Some go even tell you how, uh, how their condition was past your own. Some go draw inspiration out of your situation. But the bottom line be say, today, you are no longer that local woman. You, you are an international person today. Thank you. Sir. Thank you. Mm. May go collect your phone now. Begin the answer your call. Sharp, sharp. Okay, mm. Hello, good morning. Good morning, Jim. Yes, Nahumi and I'm Devano for radio and TV telephone. Hey, network. I... So, we go hear from the Federal Competition and Consumer Protection Commission. Okay. And then uh, we go here. I won't make the mandate secretary as you be saying now Legoshi and she be she enter Abuja. We won't use this program. Make we welcome her to Abuja. Make she connect with <coughs> people we should go they work with. I as uh, time goes on. Mm -hmm. um, Federal Competition and Consumer Protection Commission. Now, one commission when we say government saddle them with the responsibility of protecting the right of consumers as well as the peace people where they service the consumers. Madam, good morning. Good morning, sir. Ordinary president. Good yes. morning, mandate secretary. Good morning, Nigerian consumer. I actually wanted to ask about, um, my name is Olubumi. I'm from Federal Competition and Consumer Protection Commission. Um, uh, I'm a consumer education officer, and one of the responsibility of the commission is to ensure that um, we have, a, we were former CPC, Consumer Protection Commission, a council, then we became Federal Competition and Consumer Protection Commission, and then before then it was like, okay, protecting the consumer, and now the federal government said, no, not only consumer, even the, the businesses, we have to check what are you doing, what, how do you service the consumer, what are you, it's your um, service towards economic development of the country, so 
our mandate simply is to provide a level playing field for businesses and consumers to thrive. So what we are saying here, when I came this morning, I wanted to talk about full disclosure because I discovered that most times consumer comes back to say they were not informed of further details of what they buy or service that they subscribe for. Uh, recently, we have some people that came to the commission to say, okay, when we are paying for this money, they didn't tell us these are the terms and conditions regarding the service, you know. So what happened this morning now is about full disclosure, what has been happening since morning. And I want to thank Ordinary President for this initiative. It's very laudable. But one of the things that I will want to say, because this is a free um, uh, service, not that consumer is paying for it. But even that, we need full disclosure. So the consumer has the right to be told. Yes, we need the, the materials where they induce do the vaccine. Yes, the percentage of this, the percentage of that. Yes, if there is any adverse side effect, yes. let it be known. Yes, okay, thank yes. you. Yes, thank full you. disclosure. Then we also need to be guided about the age limit from what age and what age will collect the vaccine. Okay, from th this age to this age, if you collect, there might be this, there might be this material information, potential risks, adverse effects, whatever that the People need to know, please, ma, let's ensure that we have a means of communicating this to people. Because one of the things that cause all these issues is that we don't know. We were not told. And I want to tell all consumers, it's your right to ask for full disclosure. Businesses is your obligation to do full disclosure for whatever consumer is paying for. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, ma'am. I'm aware of the agency, and um, apparently, not only in immunization or vaccination, doctors and healthcare workers are trained to let every patient know what we are giving to them, especially immunization and vaccination. For babies, they'll tell you, oh, she may have a fever, buy Tylenol, or tepid sponge her. For this particular process, we have pamphlets, we have posters, we have information material, a lot online on this vaccine and disclosures, where to get it, possible adverse effects, and what you expect afterwards. And regarding the age, like he said earlier on, between 9 and 14 is when it is most effective. It doesn't mean that after 14, you cannot take it. After 45, the time that the virus will use to mutate into a cancer is not relevant anymore. So the vaccine is really a waste of time after that age. Somebody asked about 26. Yes, you can take it. But the efficacy, mm -hmm. the protection it will give you mm -hmm. is not as much as the protection it will give a 9 to 14 year old. Those, those in our pamphlets, them, and the information we will uh, get for online, yes. some Nigerians, they offline permanently. Mm -hmm. Now we, we don't get opportunity. If we want to make, we create another opportunity for Una. To come with the pamphlet, come with the, um, uh, come with the um, yes. uh, social media, whatever. Yes. Come with the links and the rest, so that people, the one who works sabi use internet, go check them. You go show people who know sabi use internet. Now the essence of this, this sensitization be this. Thank ordinary, you. Ordinary, sir. Mm, mm. If they can even do a jingle in three languages yes yeah, so they can bring it here yes yeah, so that english yoruba Ibo, the main language and even baggy because of abuja yes baggy guandara amwa amwa gade gana 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 okay cause of ike uh, thank you very much uh, ordinary president i don't think it will be of uh, emphasis to say that the major problem we have in this particular vaccine issue 
is that uh, the institution that is pushing this need to do a lot more in public education. Um, it is not, uh, it is clear, break it, the family is not against vaccination or immunization. But because of the things we have seen not happening in another country far away, inside Nigeria, the canoe experience, because of also the things we have seen and known about the people who globally are behind vaccine and immunization, we are concerned and we are asking questions. So, and assuming this institution had taken more enough time to do public education and enlightenment, being sensitive to these things that we have gone through as a nation, I am not sure we will have any need to sit and argue whether this is right or good or safe for us or not. Thank I you. think the institution need to do a lot more in public education. But it looks like and the unfortunate thing is that whenever this kind of program comes on, a lot of energy and resources is geared towards securing the vaccination. Instead of also understanding that much and resources need to be put to public education. And, and uh, sometimes when they get it, they'll go to places where they think... Hey. And because of this suggestion, you must not bring it to human rights radio and television break at a family. We have, as we speak, we have over 40 radio and TV uh, television houses in Abuja. You can go to them. Yeah. You, you, you must not come here. Simple. Others enjoy listenership, they enjoy uh, viewership. What we enjoy is different from theirs. What we enjoy is followership. So, please, we are not campaigning for you to bring anything here. Yeah. We are just advising you for you to do the needful. Simple. Sir, honestly, thank mm. you very much for that positive feedback. Mm -hmm. And is, as he has said, criticism is good for any serious government. Mm -hmm. The next time we are about to roll out such a program, advocacy, <laughs> information, education, carrying consumer protection ar ar along, yes, and carrying all media houses along, would be done months ahead a very long period before to prepare to prepare people's minds people's minds so we don't have this kind of conversations and also i was being sarcastic when i said mr gates should eliminate himself no you, you didn't say so <laughs> no i did say if you talk say you talk say if you talk say the did world did day not, of population did. say <laughs> minus one no go be bad idea well, uh, didn't mean I it enter that this way, studio sir. now i say people too much for this studio some people need to be removed and me i still stay mm. yeah, if I you am, tell me say make i come out now make number reduce now bad thing i am saying that he was preaching other things mm. if he was preaching that our population is too much he, the normal thing is to say I am so good, I surrender myself as minus one. Mm. That foundation has done a lot for us in Nigeria. They have helped us in fighting malaria, eradicating malaria, eradicating polio. What we are thinking about is controlled population. Well, yesterday I met a woman, 22 year old, with her fifth child. She was malnourished. The children were sick. She was pregnant again. It is that kind of population control, contraception, and how to help people plan their families, plan their futures, that I believe he was talking about. And finally, sir. Yes, yes, ma'am. He did say that when people come from America, they bring their medicines. And some of us, too, want American medicines. Let's not go too far. My grandmother used to bring her vegetables from the village when she's coming to visit us. There are certain kinds of food they will say they don't want Lagos one. They want their own. This one Lagos one may even be more superior. This one will be vegetable. <laughs> now, now drugs what we they talk about. Sir? What, mm. of, what, what, what of drugs? People are just used to what they are comfortable with. People are used to what 
they are used to. Madam, we know the standard day low for Nigeria. <laughs> Maybe we tell ourselves the truth. They are not sure of what is happening. But we president. tell ourselves the truth. Standard day low for Nigeria. Some Honor pure water and a pure gutter. Honor Honor president, sir. Honor Honor president, sir. Over to you, sir. And then Honor after president. you, madam. Honor President, you see, I was raising my hand for a long time. I know you were communicating other important messages. I just want to start from this background. In 1960, when people want to go to London from here, they go by ship. It takes them months to get to London. These days, they will just go to the airport. The next six hours, they are in London because of science, technology. In the vaccine war, the things that happen in the days of Pfizer is very different from what is happening now because the technology is far, far That is advanced. the rest of the world, but Nigeria has yeah. not moved forward to that level. Uh -huh. Please. Yeah. We, are, we, are coming, we are coming towards that. Then I just also wanted to mention the fact that the vaccines that are available for use in Nigeria Galaxy is produced by MSD, MSD gives to Gavi Global Alliance for Vaccine and Immunization, and it's from Gavi, it is distributed to all countries where Nigeria is a beneficiary, from the main plant in South Africa, um, London, um, US, and the rest. So it is the same vaccine that we use. And then lastly, to mention, Admiral President, sir, you see, uh, the, thank you for the video that you shared. Bill Gates Foundation has two main visions. One, improve health, especially in Africa, and then improve human capital improvements, making equity people to get rich. In the health sector, they have programs on immunization, they have programs on reproductive health, they have programs on malaria, nutrition, and the rest. In the reproductive health, the package there is very clear where they support contraceptives and the rest of the thing that controls population. When people go to the health facility, they will tell you, we want to control bed. These are the options that are available. So on that part, it's very clear. On the vision for immunization, they have the vision that is purely to bring out vaccines that are safe to the world and so on. So when they are talking about population control, they are talking about the reproductive health program that people willingly go to the facility. The women are here with us in-house, they go to the facility, they meet the reproductive health, uh, the nurses there, they will tell them, oh, this is injection, this is tablet that you can take to control health. They, they tell and them they, about, uh, about the side effect we will follow. Yeah. Well, no. One woman come out this implant where they, 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 they put. The woman begin the lean like say she won't die until she rush back, go put them again. No, what I was saying was they willingly accept. They are usually giving consent. So willingness it is out of ignorance. Yeah. Ogasa, yeah. willingness out of ignorance. Waiting so, they advertise they on the surface, waiting they beneath the thing, they different. So I just wanted to say that the support we are having on humanitarian side to develop individual capacities and reduce poverty and then the improvement of health from that foundation, yes, we know. don't need to bear it. It's very, very significant. See, and so I just want to mention that for you. the record purposes. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Ordinary uh, uh, President. Uh, good, uh, the record did there. But Nigeria uh, does not have any business being poor. Right. Talk yeah. more of one Bill Gates. Very donating vaccine to Very us. Correct. We are so rich and so Super blessed rich. that we don't have any business borrowing money from any useless country in the world. I don't know. Mismanagement of resources is our problem. So we are not beggars. It is not like uh, it, it, somebody is doing us a favor by giving us. We are asking questions. Even if you are dashing me, I want to know what you are dashing me. We are not beggars. Now, beggars no get choice. Now, you talk, say you want help. Maybe you identify, say, uh, uh, I go, uh, go school. I know carry bicycle. You won't give me bicycle. I go check the bicycle whether break day. I go check the bicycle. I have the right. Now, I don't beg you. They, what they are doing is what we call brand visibility in 
advertising. In America, poor people know they're America. In no go channel in money support people for America. Why Africa? Why Nigeria? I know one go there. I know one go there. Waiting, they go carry left hand, give you carry right hand and two legs, collect back. Yes, we know. But if waiting that they give you good, save life, the way they explain unto us, so ah, thank God, thank you. I don't know whether I don't understand. Yes, but sir. we, if our parents and our leaders, their eyes no sharp, we our eyes sharp. If they no fit ask questions because then they fear. We will know they fear. We go ask questions and you must answer us. There's nothing like, what is wrong with you? No. Answer us. We are talking about giving, introducing a, 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 a strange substance into a, the human body that we don't know what will happen in the next 10 years, in the next 15 years, in the next 20 years. That is the reason why we are asking these questions. If not, we have a lot of cases to do rather than wait to waste our airtime doing this. It is very important. A lot of people have been educated today and informed because of this. It is not a waste of time. And when we ask questions, nobody should be offended by feeling like what is difficult, what is so wrong with ordinary president. He's supposed to be educated. Education and civilization are two different things. We have professors in this country that are not civilized. You sit with them, after two hours, you'll be wondering, what is this man a professor about? Lack of civilization. Civilization with little education is more important than too, too much education. Are we together? Yes. So we are asking questions because it is our right for us to be answered. We will take calls now. Hello, good morning. Oh, we'll, we'll come back to you. Ma. I'm sorry. Ma. Hello, good morning. Good morning. Uh, good morning, my ordinary president. What is your name? Where you did offer? What is your contributor? My name is Christian Obiwane. I did call from New York. Christian United Obiwane of America. from New York. Uh, my ordinary, I won't quickly run through mouth for this uh, topic we will discuss this morning and concerning this vaccine thing and uh, one or two things where our daddy that is careful talk. You don't finish the talk already. Um, to call Nigeria, first of all, trust the medicine waiting for Nigeria. The government will need to give us assurance. Maybe the same Nigeria when our president had the do them or the London, the Royal Enter flight go London or France. Now you go from America, come back, they think the same medicine waiting do for the side the same Nigeria. No people waiting on top refuse to take. But we tell ourselves the truth now. The leadership get problem and they need to convince us as Nigerians, say the system wouldn't put on ground, wouldn't they assure us with the ground, say the work. It's beginning Before to work it, now. it is beginning, it is part of the signs that the system is big, system is beginning to work, that you saw the Minister of Interior yesterday, that you are seeing the mandate Secretary Health and Environment in the studio today for government people engagement. That is Thank you very much, a sir. sign that the system is beginning to work. I hope we, I just a little comment from your mouth, we agree. Talk, Njoku come here the other day. Say, could they come? We don't see him again, he don't run. Who? Njoku? Because of... No, uh, nah, because... Uh, we don't see the, uh, <laughs> No, be police service commission, uh, some commission. Uh, yes, uh, now, uh, yes, now you don't oh, run. Don't see you know now. why you no come? <laughs> I carry the airtime, give them for free. I carry airtime, give police service commission for free. So anything, most of the times, things where they give person for free, you know, they, oh, it, no. sometimes they, they know the value. Them. If police service yes. commission won't cough for this station, they must pay and they go pay heavily. Thank so, you. So now that, that's one now one. Secondly, you see this uh, issue of uh, controlling 
population. At the period of poverty, you then born of seven, and after that, my father died. We had a very, we do very small when he died. Mm. I suffer. Mm -mm. I do nine years. They sell ice water for really the kind of from relay to national theater along that road. I know it's in poverty. No. So when we so talk about that age, reduce, see, listen, my friend, from that age, now you become an entrepreneur. I agree, sir. Look at I it from that a one. positive perspective. Now I agree, make you succeed coming, today. As so. come somewhere, mm -hmm. my husband had to come. Land. The system when we get on ground now, with that time when we talk, technology never come out. Mm. People wait there for safety, they caution us when they do something where they wrong. Mm. And when we see people, not even their family member, we they hide because mm. that can go flog us. Mm. Nowadays, it won't be like that mm. anymore. Very true. It won't be like that anymore. And some parents go even go to the one teacher when they try to caution their beginning. So now, if they be waiting for everybody with the call, then they come back, they all come in. Then. <laughs> so, we go need to do something. Text me, well, see the baba where you call our, our lovely sister with them break her hand here. The papa be like, two wives he get. Mm. Eh? You could barely feed one see. with the children. Mm. It will go carry another one. Mm. So we're going to need to look for a way where we will take, make our people understand, see, look, we put more energy in trying to develop Ma and trying to build better future than burning, burning, burning. Man, man, go stand for your front like lantern rope. Say, he got uh, two wives, uh, nine children. <laughs> you, yes. Person waste time for your friend, no straight. He built a lantern lo rope. <laughs> so, let me be the king. Not to say this America, when we do a better pass in Nigeria, they need better pass us. But the system, they work. The system, they work. I they watch for news yesterday. I see one of oh, our yeah, ministers, they talk about the reason why they buy land cruiser for them. Why they need oh, yeah, to of power or something bigger. Say the road no good. Is he not even ashamed of himself? Talking say the road for the country will be as a senator or whatever. No good. Who they talk so? One of for our ministers who they justify the reason why they buy land cruiser, where they buy expensive vehicles for them. They don't even get shame for us. Serious? They don't get shame. Who be the minister? Name and make we shame him. Senator from from Kogi West. Yeah. They do justify why they go buy note of one hundred and say after four years. Sabi senator, be yeah, you are active now. Okay, thank the you. The one with the combine after four years, what do they go use and do? Thank they you. go throw them. No, no eh? worry. And we get Nigerian we, made vehicles where they're supposed to be used. They're not being used and then they go. They are called. They, they, they carry money. They give Japanese. You no get guarantees. Uh, Nigeria made vehicles go de go de standard. Uh. And who go ensure the people say the guarantee uh -huh. they So, I beg. You know, like the best in the instigate. When people did it for us, he used that for in four years. Nothing happened to the models. Mm. For one day, we know you say he break down for road. Okay, thank you very much, sir. Thank you. No problem, Lord. Now, God bless you. Amen. Let's go. Oh, no, 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 no. Unab. Thank you. Yes, madam, you be one talk. Yes, honorary president, I be one talk. Because as I watch that video, I say... You be person where you believe in truth. If you see truth, you they talk them. So I feel say I know if you just keep quiet, go without <coughs> mentioning some of the things where I notice about the video because if I say you give us make we watch, make we give our own comments. The first thing where I notice be say the first part of the clip, then they interview Bill Gates, and in the talk say the the thing where Africa need now education for girls. They need nutrition. They need to create opportunities for the youth. And then the youth, in fact, na the, na the wealth of Africa. Because we get plenty youth. And if we educate them, give them opportunities, you get something with demographers, they call demographic dividend. Nigeria go reap demographic dividend if we invest in our youth. He can't talk all those things. Well, talk, finish. The woman they interview them. Then after the interview, then come bring another person. We talk the thing where Bill Gates no talk. Then inside they come put Bill Gates picture in and out. You know, say these days with, um, okay. with with technology, people can create any type of video. Madam, I understand, sir. Yeah, no, no, I will send you the complete interview. 
Doctor, wait till I be one talk. Be say, yeah. I don't see. I don't see the work, like Dr. Bassi say. I don't see the work when they do. I know some people, they feel, say, the thing where they do, you get a ulterior motive. But if you look at what he has said and how the foundation has supported different countries, then it's very hard to come to a different conclusion. I, I, I didn't want to leave here without airing my views on that. Thank you. Then the last thing I want to say, Honorable um, President, um, Ordinary President, I want to really, really thank you because this is your platform. Eh? You know what it be. Mm -hmm. Like you talk, you say you get followers. People, they follow you. And I'm grateful that you give us the opportunity to come and reinforce waiting more than 15 years of scientific evidence don't show. Say... This vaccine, the HPV vaccine, say in they safe. Say in they prevent cervical cancer. And say it is cost effective because prevention is better than cure. And I also want to end on the note that I don't feel say any human being, any woman, man, go feel giving picking something will go make them sick or something will no good for them. As you, I talked before. You don't think. I don't think. As I talked before, me myself, I don't give my children the, the vaccine. Me, I be doctor. I cannot be promoting something where I know say bad. I can't promote something where I know say bad. In fact, I can't give my children something where I know say bad. You can be used ignorantly, man. I know sure say. I know sure say they, they, they use us. Some of the teachers, uh, well, they, they teach you now for medical school. See Mizus now. You they see Mizus again. Uh -huh. We they see Moses again. Which one be Moses? The time when I day young, person before you become before you get that to fifty years. That one where they use wine to cure. Yes. No, the one where they write rub white white powder. No, be the one where they calamine they, they lotion. Go put you see the una una see they see them <laughs> now vaccine night night come out them now. They say. Me gonna clap for her. Me gonna clap for her. Thank you. We know they see them again. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, ma. Thank you. Uh, uh, hello, good morning. Good morning, my ordinary president. Yes, what will be your name? Where, do you, where are you Devano from? My name is Chris Oya. I'm Devano from Dublin. Okay, Chris Oya from Dublin. What will be your contributor? Oh, yeah. My contribution, my contributor, is to say, first of all, thank you very much for what you're doing in that country in Nigeria. And congratulations for the, another feather that has been added onto your feather. Mm -hmm. My ordinary president, thank you for the video you showed this morning. These people, the West, they don't have any good intention for Africa. Not all. Somebody is telling us, the woman was telling us what Bill Gates is bringing to Nigeria, how he's helping Nigeria. Is he telling us what he's taking out of Nigeria? He's not taking out, telling us how he's taking, what they are taking out of Nigeria. They are, he's telling us they are fighting malaria. Oh, really? Ask that woman, when was the last time America had malaria? The way they, are fight, they will fight malaria in Nigeria, is that the way they eradicated malaria in America? It's not quite long America eradicated malaria. Malaria will be only be eradicated by cleanliness. That's it. This vaccine, they are pushing onto our people. Sorry, I had to... Cut you off. I you feel your temperature don't they rise and um, uh, we here we know they instigate. You know they instigate. If you permit, just one minute. Word go long. You know go long. Just uh, one minute. Be... Hello. Just good one morning. Minute. <laughs> Hello. Good morning. Yes. Oh, very present. What is your name? Where are you from? My name is Katie Rayburn. I'm calling from the United Kingdom, sir. Hey, Jury. First of all, I want to, mm. not to take much of your time. I want to say a big thank you, sir, for the great work you are doing for mm. the fellow Nigerians, both in Nigeria and diaspora. Mm. And my contribution is towards the PHV vaccine. One, first of all, I want to appreciate that uh, we are now aware that we need to prevent uh, uh, women, but the thing we have concern about is not that the HPV vaccine is working or not. What we are, what our concerns are, is that the right products are being sent to Nigeria 
and other African countries. Because someone called from the United Kingdom saying that the children took it and they are fine. Yes, that is the product that is in the kingdom, United Kingdom here. We are concerned about the product that has been sent to Nigeria because they see us as a third world country. But we are not. So we have to make sure that the vaccine is given to them at the right, uh, in the right product is given to our people. And also for the women, here we, they check us uh, three, uh, every three years. That is when the women should be checked, not the one that they talked about, say, certain ages, because the gap of that test is just too broad, sir. Thank you. Because if they do it at that pace, people, women will still die Thank easily. You. Because Thank three you. years is the time they should be checking them for the care, Thank checking their, their ovaries and making sure that they don't yeah. have any symptoms yeah. of the virus. Sir. Okay. Thank and you. that is what I have to uh, Thank you. Make I want to say a big that. thank you for thank your you. work. and. Uh, Ezekiel David come back. He said, My children <laughs> just finished that sickness called Mizus just now. <laughs> Is he there? And uh, then somebody said, <laughs> Every day I come in, they make me laugh. Now, this is how I'm worried. He said, Now, go go around with a Go go around with a cola. Make you choose hospital on the big key. <laughs> Some of us, eh? Some of these olden days things where we don't get scientific proof just because of, you know, lack of, um, just because of superstitious beliefs and the rest. We go to do some things so that we can go come die. Uh, okay, because of an Ike. <laughs> now go go around with a crawler you want to. <laughs> Ordinary present. You get one way I just remember. That one way then they take one line like wood, put for head, for <laughs> Hickok. Uh, and did they work now? Did they work? Hickok go just disappear. Uh, and I don't know how our mother, the doctors go know. <laughs> <laughs> even they no use them for you, doctor. You they do They use them. They use them. Uh, 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 Army love. He said I had measles and chicken pox even with the, the vaccine. Okay, so uh, okay. your parting words be called. My before. parting words, honorary president. As we are in Nigeria now, Gadaxil is already being used in the private clinics. Because when they use them for private clinic, no means say now authority be organ. Please tell us what waiting go make sense to us, sir. Please. How many people they go private clinic? That's what I'm trying to say, Honorable President. They go there to pay money, but this time around, it's coming into Nigeria free of charge for those. No, be people they use their money go buy sniper to kill themselves. Because then they go use money by the poison to kill themselves. If you mean say I they genuine I I be they normal. Ogasa, go do research. Make you come back, talk to come talk at our level. You are too advanced in your explanation. Go try. Do a deliberate condescension to come down to our level and explain to us. Anytime where you they talk, majority of the people know they understand you. I they observe body language. Now true, I've been a lie. <laughs> so thank you. <laughs> you know, one person goes to school too much. Your example now up up. We will not go to school. Our head they down down. But by the time this man, all the examples where they give now very good examples, but the the example pass our head. I don't know whether I want to understand. I don't know whether I want to understand. Yes, Carry university lecturer and make you go teach primary school students. You go, they talk, but they're not going to go understand. I don't know whether you understand. Teaching is going elementary in your explanation. This man has been there he knows this thing inside out. How to bring it out to his peers, fantastic. To our level, not yet. This is a practical 
analysis. Are we together? Yes, sir. Make we appreciate her. <laughs> my brothers, my sisters, if I look at and I say, time don't they give us signal, signal to do things. Signal, make we pack Kaya Komo for studio without, not without apologizing to the uh, commission, um, what do you mean? National Commission for Persons with Disability. We won't beg them if they go get chance come tomorrow, so that we go give on enough time because we, we, uh, we, persons with disability, yes, we are many. Yes, sir. <laughs> Anybody where you see, we complete today is a prospective member of our association. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Me, I'm a member already. <laughs> My eye know they see far like before. <laughs> what did the few do before? With Not age, all of you them, can't even do I don't do you understand. Yes, sir. Example. <laughs> Ask my wife. <laughs> <laughs> it's a big disability. <laughs> man go there alive. If two things die, man don't go. <laughs> what, sir? Eyes. And I, <laughs> <laughs> Monday <Mandate> secretary, <laughs> man, fit they alive, but you don't die. When eyes don't go, I, oh, I, I don't, don't go. go. <laughs> 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 oh, no, no, no. Okay, thank more. you, sir. And thank tomorrow, you, sir. when I go here, a Nigerian will come up with one innovation within the agricultural sector. Chemical fertilizer don't kill our crops, don't kill many human beings. Some lands in the north, today you can't plant anything and expect it to germinate because chemical fertilizer don't kill them. Then you need fertilizer year in, year out. Why? Because the chemical fertilizer don't kill the soil. Now, a Nigerian came up with a probiotic innovation organic fertilizer liquid where they use soya beans use a bag of rice use other things to form the bacteria we will form the probiotics now grass where don't they die if you mix them through where after three four days one week the grass don't turn green my farm for house, some things don't they die. I don't tire. I collect one, mix them inside 20 liters of water, 200 liters, spray. All of them don't germinate. The fruits don't come up, cucumber, tomatoes, and the rest. This is 100% Nigeria, Nigerian. Tomorrow, we will go hear about that one. So that we go throw away the chemical where we they consume through the food where we they chop for Nigeria. And some people they suffer from many, many things as a result of lifestyle and waiting with they consume. On behalf of everybody waiting for inside the open air studio. Monday secretary go talk last word before we go talk say when I buy. Monday secretary, you have the man and the date today. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's been a very interesting experience my first time in a studio like this not even only in Abuja but ever open court I say it as and I always say a very big tool for advocacy is our mouth Leaders that are respected, community elders, religious elders. Yesterday we had the Emir of Kachingo come and tell our girls that this vaccination is safe. I want to implore all of us to do one for ten. For everything we have heard here today, say to ten people and implore those ten people to do another ten. And I believe that our health indices in this state will be better and health is wealth. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Make when I appreciate her. My brothers, my sisters, if when I look down on a sister time, don't they give us signal? Signal. We make we 
park Kaya Kama for studio. Tomorrow, when I go see small Peking, we apply for admission for Nile University. She apply for um, cyber cyber security. She get A1 for computer science. They say space no day for her. No, for the first time we go face Nile University. Una waiting. Flavored milk drink comes in apple flavor and orange flavor. Contains calcium, helps in supporting strong bones. Visual BB Star for Smart Kid.